me want the journey. The journey rough, but show must go on. I saw the thing set. What me tell you, say, more than the sun don't shine for me. I'm the only thing bright, my dignity. Right place to stand beside the Almighty. I saw me live my life. What me tell you, say. Just just cleared a shit ton of requests. All right, good. Yo, Steamy for the 300 bits said, I like bits, and Ava for the sub. I didn't see those. Dude, Nodi goes out so fast now. Like, seven months ago, it would be like three to five minutes. I go live, that shit, imme y'all are immediately saying, hello, hello, Joe, Joe, Joe. Hello, everybody floating in... You're late? I'm barely late, okay? I like, I, yo, you can say, yeah, I understand. You're allowed to say you're late because I'm fucking late, right? But, like, normally you'll withhold the late to when I'm, like, a half hour fucking late. I was, like, six minutes late, chat, okay? Six minutes? Is that really that big of a fucking deal? Sam for the sub, Mr. for the sub. How are you guys doing on this fine goddamn Wednesday? Uh, we're finishing As Dusk Falls today, so that's a dub in the fucking chat. This is our third stream of the game. I will do a recap for the people that have not been here for either one of the streams or both streams. Uh, it's not a complicated game to pick up. Um, it's a story game. I'll literally just describe what has happened. Not, I mean, a lot has happened, but I could probably describe it in like two minutes. Uh, the premise of the game is that you guys basically decide everything. Most story games I play, I usually get your guys' input and just decide myself. In this one, you guys literally vote in chat, uh, and what you vote happens in the game, which is pretty fucking cool. Um, but yeah, do uh, Dookie for the sub, May for the sub, XO and Reverb for the sub, Cole for the sub, Sam for the sub. So many fucking subs off rip. Um, but yeah, we're going to be finishing this game today. Tomorrow, we're going to be doing Unbans and Toilet Chronicles, which is a scary game, uh, supposedly. <laughs> Friday, we're going to be doing React. Saturday, I'll be doing Fortnite and Val. We moved Spy Party with Zussie till next Saturday because he'll be in Cali. Uh, and then Sunday, Reacts. And then Monday is going to be my birthday stream chat. My birthday is in five days. I repeat, my birthday is in five days. I will be 21 years old in five days. Oh, my God. I can't wait to lose all my money gambling in five days. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait to be financially ruined after losing everything at the casino in five fucking days. On my birthday, I've decided we're moving Minecraft. Minecraft Monday is normally on Monday, but since my birthday is Monday, next Monday I won't do Minecraft. We're going to be doing my birthday stream. We'll move Minecraft to next Wednesday. But on my birthday stream, we're probably just going to be chilling. Uh, doing a watch party or two of maybe some long YouTube videos, and then we might do some Valorant if I'm drunk. <laughs> Depending, right? I don't know how the stream's gonna go yet, but somebody said buy scratch-offs. Buddy, you can buy scratch-offs at 18. That is the most anticlimactic shit. Yo, chat. Yeah, on Monday, I'm gonna be buying some scratch-offs and scratching them off on stream. What degenerate shit is that? That is so fucking sad. You're going to get high too? Yeah, probably. Bro, I don't know. Sell your setup to the casino? Yeah, let me let, let me wager my fucking stream setup at, at Atlantic City. Gubba for the sub. Envil for the sub. Wazi for the 300 bets. I'm a new viewer. Where were you yesterday? Tuesdays is my off day. Uh, I am not live on Tuesdays. I do a lot of my homework on Tuesdays because I'm still in college. Uh, so it gives me kind of a day to catch up. Uh, and I'm live every other day of the week. Next Sunday, I won't be live because it's the Super Bowl. But uh, I'll be live every day but Tuesday. <laughs> That's generally my schedule. 4.30 EST on weekdays, uh, 2 p.m. on weekends. Bam for the sub, BKs for the sub, Dookie for the sub. Are y'all ready to get into the fucking game? Somebody said, why can't I donate a dollar? Because then people would spam TTS, and so I have it set for 300 bets. C for the sub, Gubba for the sub, Meow for the 300 bets. All right. If you weren't here, you're looking fit as shit. Thank you. Yo, I'm getting a tattoo next Tuesday, chat. Y'all want to see what I'm getting? Yo, off topic. I ain't give a fuck. I ain't give a fuck. 
I'm getting it on my thighs. Bro, this is like, I thought I was going to be getting this tattoo in like two months. Um, but then uh, we I emailed them and they literally hit me back almost immediately. I'm going to be getting this. Um, hold up. Yo, chat, rate it out of 10. Oh, wait, you guys don't know what it says. <laughs> I'm going to get the top word on my on my le or on my right thigh and the bottom word on my left thigh right now you might be saying joe what the fuck does this say it's you know these out on it means know thyself in greek right it's one of the three aphorisms on uh the hall of Apo or the temple of apollo it just means know thyself uh so it's pretty chill yeah now i know uh, the reason you might you might be like joe you're not Greek and you can't read Greek. So why the fuck are you getting that shit in Greek? Because that's what it was originally wrote in. Somebody said this shit's ass. Yo, everybody that says this shit's ass is the same motherfucker that's about to get a rose and a clock on their fucking arm. Be original, dickhead. Every motherfucker, every guy, when they get a tattoo in college, gets a fucking full sleeve of a tiger, a fucking lion, and a goddamn like old ass clock maybe get more original right maybe get something that's uh to you rather than uh you know i'm gonna get the rocks tattoo i'm gonna get some tribal shit right because dwayne johnson looks so sick May uh yo good shit the tattoo looks dope uh except dwayne the rock johnson is 6'4 and 240 you're fucking five six 100 pounds i don't think a really big ass tribal tattoo fits you right anyways anyways yeah, yeah, come at my tattoos. I'm about to come at yours, dickhead. Motherfucker's got a whole ass... Motherfucker's got a whole ass clown tattoo down his fucking forearm. Yeah, it looks so cool, right? Yeah. Oh my god, it really represents... It represents my personality, right? The demon inside of me is the lion, right? And then when you go over to the clock, it represents how short life is. And then the rose is to, is to represent my love of roses. Yeah, maybe you get more fucking original, asshole. Fuck you. Anyways... Yeah. <laughs> Bro, dead ass. That's what I hate about, yo, I'm so mean. I'm not, though. I'm not. Right? Like, you can get whatever the fuck you want per tattoo. But when, it's like, everybody is so unoriginal today with tattoos. Like, right? Like, get something that is, like, to you, right? It doesn't have to be something that other people don't have, right? Because the tattoo that I just showed you guys, a lot of people have. But it's something that is original to me, and I, I it's something that I like, right? Whereas when you get, like, a fucking cool-ass uh, design tattoo that has absolutely zero meaning and takes up the entirety of your fucking thigh, and you spent $5,000 on the tattoo, uh, that's pretty shitty, right? Or when somebody gets, like, a whole-ass sleeve of, like, their favorite show... <laughs> when you're fucking 80, you're not gonna like that show anymore, asshat. Si uh, Simone for the fucking five gifted. Thank you for the five gifted, Simone Mango for the sub black code for the fringe bats. When I turn 18, I want a tattoo that says send or be sent. What do you think? Don't give me no cheesy BS. It's your body up to you. What do you mean send or be sent? If that is in reference to Nelk full send, for the love of God, do not get that tattoo. If that, what do you mean by send or be sent? Nap for the three inch bets. Happy you're streaming. My hamster died yesterday. F in the chat. I'm sorry that your hamster died. Ace and Mark for the sub. Justin for the sub. Secrets for the sub. M13 for the sub. Alex for the three inch bitties. Sweet 16 is the third, and I'm excited to watch your uh, birthday stream a couple days later. Big dub. Sensei for the three inch bits. Sensei Wu Wise Words Wednesday. The harder the climb, the better the view. Now that's a W. Now that's a W fucking quote. Iceman for the three inch bits. Bought the new Rainbow Six Siege Blackberry uh, Pear Vanilla using your code. Big dub. Joe B. Code Joe B. Gfield.com. C for the sub. Meow for the three inch bits. Gubba. Envil for the sub. Ham for the sub. Wadzi for the three inch bits. I uh, already read that one. Fuck. Yo, Simone for the sub. Poop for the three inch bits. Uh, I watch you in the bath. That's weird. XX Bomber for the sub. Yo, chat. Where are you guys watching me right now? I guarantee 90% of the people taking a shit or eating. One of the two. Simone for the sub. Bobat for the sub. Teen Apples for the four inch bits. Today's my birthday. A happy birthday. Bobat for the five gifted. Uh, Doug for the sub. Black uh, code for the three inch bits. He's not even close. It means go 
fool out or we'll come back and bite you in the ass if that makes sense. Then that's a good idea. AVZ for the sub. I would just be worried that most people that read that tattoo are going to assume that it means full send. Because I didn't know what you meant. Or maybe I'm just stupid. One of the two. But it is a good idea. Anyways. Recap of the game before we get in chat. You weren't here last As Dusk Fall stream because this is the last one that we're doing. Because we're going to finish the game today. If you weren't here last time or the time before. Base of the story. Right? Family. I'm playing this dude named Vincent. He's got a wife. Wife's cheating on him. L. Dickhead energy. They have a kid. Wife dies. We got her shot. Uh-oh. We're held up at a motel. Uh, there's this family called the Holtz. We're playing this one kid named Jay. You're playing two characters. We play Vincent and Jay, right? Jay's the youngest brother. They robbed uh, the sheriff. Holding up a motel, they kill the wife. On the run. Vincent escapes. Jay betrays his brother. That's it. Does that make sense? Was that a good recap? I don't know. Yo, was that a W recap or was that a shitty recap? Did that make any sense? That's exactly what's happened, though, in the last fucking two streams. Is today Valorant? No, it's Wednesday. Tomorrow, we might do Val after Toilet Chronicles, depending on how long it takes. I don't know for sure, though. But Saturday, we might do Val, too, because we're going to be doing Fortnite Saturday. Done, so if we don't do it Thursday, it's not a big deal. Done for the sub MR for the 300 bets. Hope you're having a good day. I know you talked about 1v1ing bears and wolves. Which one do you think you could take on a kangaroo? Absolutely. I would beat the piss out of a kangaroo. They would die in 10 seconds. Um, I understand that a lot of people are going to say, Joe, they're like seven feet tall and they have like stronger punches than MMA fighters. My counter argument is they don't have opposable thumbs. And so I hop on their back and I literally just choke the shit out of the kangaroo. It dies. And then I walk, I walk away for, uh, like, uh, victorious, right? Uh, it's losing. It's losing. They don't have opposable thumbs, right? If they don't have opposable thumbs, I'm immediately less scared of it. Uh, cause it can't grab me. Uh, Danny for the 300 bits, you should rate viewers tattoos. I don't want to do that because that will be, um, very upsetting for a lot of people, right? If I rate somebody, like, okay. When I rated y'all's Halloween costumes, if I didn't like your Halloween costume, it's whatever, right? If you show me your fucking full sleeve tattoo that you spent $6,000 on and it's on your lot, it's on your body for the rest of your life. And I say, oh my god, that looks like the biggest piece of shit I've ever seen in my entire life. You're going to be pretty upset. You know what I mean? You're not going to like that. Right? Because, and, and that's also not really, like, how many of you guys have tattoos? If you have a tattoo, say I. I would assume maybe 30% of my chat has a tattoo. Like, not that many. Not that many people. Mars Nace for the sub, David from 3 Inch Bets. I bought G Fuel and didn't use code Joe B. Oh shit, a lot of you guys have tattoos. Holy fuck. I feel like you guys are lying, though. Black for the, for the 300 bits. Uh, Cole Lee for the 1,000 bits. Thinking about moving out of state. Got any suggestions? Currently live in Texas. Uh, do you want to move? Do you want to stay in the South? That's the biggest question, right? If you want to stay in the South, your options are limited. If you want to go anywhere, you could go... Uh, I would not advise New Jersey, right? Yeah, weed's legal in New Jersey, dub. But, like... New Jersey doesn't have much going for it. I would say don't move to Jersey. Uh, move to... Yo, chat, where should they move? I don't know. Anywhere. Marsnace for the twenty uh, for the 28-month sub. Damn. And Cully for the for the fringe bets. You ever thought that somebody has a tattoo of your face? No, nobody has a tattoo of my face. Uh, actually, maybe one person does. Statistically. Maybe like some dumbass one. I feel like I would have seen it, though. Actually, no, somebody did send me that they had a tattoo of my face. It was like this big, though. And it didn't even really look like me. It was kind of like a stick figure. All right. Let's begin. That's weird as fuck. I know. Everybody's saying move to Ohio. Yeah, don't move to Ohio. Not even because of the meme. Ohio is just mid. Like, I've been to Ohio. It's not that cool. B-Wubs for the sub black code for the 400 bets. Do the rating of the tattoos. Tell everybody to not be a bitch if you don't like it. Bro, but still, like, that, like I'm going to feel bad. Like, if somebody, like, has a really, ta like, a really, like, meaningful tattoo to themselves, and I'm like, wow, that's so stupid. Like, you know how fucking shitty that would make me seem? Like, I'm, I'm going to feel so bad. 
if I'm like, oh yeah, no, this tattoo is is for my grandma, and it's like a portrait of their grandma, and it's like really ja like like janky, and the eyes are fucked up. You ever seen one of those? This is a portrait for my dead grandma, and it's like the fucking shittiest photo of them, and it's like it's like they went to like a fire hall to get it tattooed instead of like a genuine tattoo place. And it's like literally the worst tattoo you've ever seen. Like, let me pull up a picture. Hold up. Bad tattoo portraits. Bro, because there's so many like this. My son, Jimmy, my son, Jimmy ha he went missing. And then they show me a picture of this. Like, Ariana Grande is a real inspiration to me. And then they show me one of these photos. Like, I'm not, yo, like, I'm not, yo. Like, I know it wouldn't be that bad, realistically. But, like, there's some that are, like, just not good. Like, let me find one that's, like, eh. My dad. Wait, no, this isn't even my dad. No. This is literally a famous person. I gotta find one that's just like a ram random family photo. You know what I mean, though? Like, I don't want to be an asshole in that way. Like, if it's just some, like, uh, like cool tattoo and I don't like it, like, whatever. But, like, yeah, like this. Like this. I got a tattoo to commemorate my grandma. Bro, that shit looks like a raisin. They made... She already looks old here. They made her age 35 years. And this was on Ink Master. I remember seeing this episode of Ink Master. Like, that's insane. Like, that's bad. Like, that's really bad. Like, like I, yo, if I somebody showed me that, I would not be able, I wouldn't be able to, like, hold it. You know when, like, somebody asks you, hey, does this look good? And you can lie and be like, yeah. Like, there's some points where, like, I can't hold that, like, that cap in. Right? Like, I ha like I would, I would immediately go, Poof. Like, I would, that would be a, f I would be flabbergasted, that's it, like, or this. Like, this, sh they just look so bad. Like, dude, I, like, I would not be able to get this tattoo and walk away and be like, yeah, that was a great tattoo. I would be like, holy fuck, they botched the shit out of that. Simone for the five gifted. Thank you, Simone, for the five gifted subs. I don't know if I'm saying your name right. Thank you for the ten gifted this stream. Zombie for the sub. I haven't even gotten into the game yet. Easily for the fringe bits. Damn, your grandma ugly as fuck. Yo, don't even insult the tattoo. Just insult the grandma. Oh my god. Yellow from Thringe Bits. Do you actually end stream when somebody requests end stream? Nobody's ever requested it. Because it's 10 million channel points. It's kind of a waste of channel points. Uh, in all honesty. Sewer from Thringe Bits. What if we do our bad tattoos and like whoever has the worst wins? We could do that. That would be the only way around it. Death for the sub. Aquid for the five Jibets. Get Rainbow Six Siege and play it on Friday. I already have Rainbow and no. Curtis for the five. Uh, if you were magically to turn into a girl, would you let your homies hit? No. What? Th yo, that is like the that is like the most common fucking friend group question ever. Yo, if you were a girl, would you like would you like do it with any with any of the guy? No, no, immediately no. Are you fucking kidding me? You, you, no, that because that means you're attracted to your friends, right? Like that means you're attracted to your friends. Because if you say yes. That's not, like, they're still your friends. Even if you were, even if you poofed magically in, in, and you were, like, a woman, right? Like, you, you're you still, you're still attracted to your friends, right? I'm not attracted to my friends. No. So, no, I would not do that. H3 for the sub, goo, our gut for the sub. All right, can we get into the game now, chat? I think it's time to game. We got, we got to get off topic on the fucking tattoo shit. Somebody said, I got a boyfriend. Yay. I have no friends. Oh, my God. Like, like, why, like, why is there always one person that, like, I'm sorry to hear that, right? But it's like, it's like somebody asks a hypothetical, hey, like, would you ever, like, kill your friend for this amount of money? I have no friends. Like, bro, like, yeah, like, you, okay, you know the hypothetical, though. Like, you know someone. Right, like, you know someone that could apply to the question. Even if you're like, okay, yeah, I don't have friends. Like, bro, like, oh my god. Like, it's like, like, I, yeah, like, damn. Like, what? Are you getting weed on your birthday? Oh, yeah. Because <coughs> it's legal in New Jersey. When I'm 21, I'll be able to smoke it legally. 
Black for the 300 bits. Half of my money goes to you, not going to lie. Well, stop spending stop spending as much money on my stream. Damn. Thank you for the 300 bits. You don't have to send me money. It is entirely optional. Are you getting drunk on your birthday? Probably not. No, like, I have class the next day. I My birthday is on Monday. I have class on Tuesday. Like, I'll hit the dab card a bit. Like, bro, I'm not getting plastered. I'm going to be live at 430. Like, you think I'm going to be getting fucking drunk? You better get drunk? Bro, come on. Like, yeah, see, y'all already peer pressuring me. Peer pressure, peer pressure, peer pressuring me, peer pressuring me. I caught a peer pressure. Stop peer pressuring me. Stop peer pressuring me into doing bad things. Stop peer pressuring me, chat. Fuck. And, yo, there it is. Yeah, okay. Bro, like, will I take a shot or two on Monday? Yeah, probably. Will I have a few drinks? Yeah, probably. Will I rip the card a bit? Yeah, probably. Am I going to get, like, blackout drunk on stream? No. Number one, that's TOS. Number two, I don't want to do that. I have class the next day. That would be atrocious. Black code for the 300 bits. Said, make me stop. Well, I can't. Simone for the... Yeah. Why is that not, why is it not TTSing? I... Oh shit, why was that so delayed? What the fuck? Thank you for the 5,000 biddies. God damn. I got cheated on, so Joe is making me feel better. Yo, L, L cheater, not you. L the person that cheated on you. Damn. Well, I don't know if the person that cheated on you is a guy or girl, so I can't say L boyfriend or girlfriend. Regardless, L person that cheated on you. Massive L. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, getting cheated on is not fun. And it's also kind of cringe. I'm sorry that you had to go through that. I, f I feel like I downgraded what you're going through. I'm sorry if that if that came off that way. It does suck. I'm sorry that you got cheated on. But I'm glad I could help. Uh, and Simone, thank you for the gifteds and the 5,000 biddies. Black out for the 300 bits. They cheated on you with me. What? All right. Simone for the 5,000 biddies. Big dub. Thank you for the bi fucking bits. L person that cheated on you. Let's get into the game. I'm already going to crack a G Fuel. I'm feeling a G Fuel. Off rip. All right. Which? Crash Bandicoot or Blue Bomber? Stop stalling. I'm not stalling. We're going to finish the game. You're acting like I'm stalling for like three hours so I can just end the stream and not play the game. I'm going to fucking finish the game. The stream will just be longer. God damn. Fuck. Everybody, yo, that y'all are dead split. It looks like more people are saying crash. All right. We'll do crash. This is the last crash I have. I think. Yeah. All right. Let's get into it. Oh, not this fucking kid. I forgot about this kid. What's this dickhead's name? I didn't include him in the fucking recap. I tried to get him killed like 10 times, chat. We've been trying to get him murdered. We've been trying to get him murdered. Ash. Yeah, no. Yeah, I've been trying to get him killed. Oh, my God. Bro, like, so annoying. No, there was, like, there was a... If you were here last stream, there was a point where he was in the woods and he, like, fell down. And, like, couldn't get up. Like, some life alert type shit. And, I, it, like, it gave me every opportunity to save his life. And I didn't. And he still lived. And I was like, bro, you're fucking kidding me. But he's got plot armor. Don't worry. I'm gonna surpass that shit. He's gonna die this stream. Guaranteed. Not really. Because the game might not let him die. Because he's a kid. Damn. Do you think the game would let them die? There probably is a game scenario where Zoe and Ash die. We're going to get Ash killed. Good shit. All right. We've already determined that, chat. I'm going to use all my overrides to have that happen. Simone for the fucking 3,200 biddies. He cheated on me with my best friend. But the girl he cheated on me with, she can't beat me in anything. But then his best friend told me he likes me. Yo, fuck your best friend 
Fuck your ex-boyfriend. Ow, motherfuckers. That is so fucked. Your best friend? Your best friend, bro? Oh, my God. Yo, that is so... That is so fucked. That is so fucked. I am sorry to hear that. His best friend told me he likes me. See, now, are you saying, like, you're gonna get with his best friend? I don't know if that's a good option. Just because that's probably gonna change so much shit. Maybe even for the worst. But, damn. I am sorry you're going through that. And think of it the 3,200 biddies. That is fucking whack. King Mofu for the tier two. Says, how much was your gold chain? I don't even remember. I got it. It's not 24 karat. A lot of people ask me that. That's, no, that shit's 14. That shit's the lowest amount of gold. You think I'm going to be getting 24 karat gold just to flex? Dickhead, I ain't need that shit. Uh, I don't know how much my chain is. I got it like, what, two years? Not two years ago. Almost two years ago, actually. Uh, no, if the sub uh, and black code for the 300 bits. Now I feel horrible for making a joke about it. Well, yeah. You did make a joke about it. H3 for the 300 bits. All right. Yes, is my camera laggy? No, it did look laggy for a second. I think my eyes are lagging. Hold up. Refresh. All right, now the Matrix refreshed. Juvenile for the 300 bits. There's this girl who keeps talking about her problems to me. Do I tell her I don't give a shit? Just leave her on red. The fuck? Why? You don't have to tell her you don't care. That's fucked. Cully for the 300 bits. If you were to try weed, you would be like Graham from Grandpa's Try Weed for the first time. Well, I'm literally going to hit a dab card on stream Monday. So, I mean, you can see it then. I <laughs> We for the 300 bets. Just saw that absolutely ass take about Balt. He's cool as fuck. He doesn't have the powers. Yo, you're really bringing up... Y'all are trying... Yo, motherfuckers saying I'm stalling. You're trying to start arguments with me, chat. Motherfuckers tell me Balt's a good movie. Balt is the shittiest movie ever. Balt is a bad movie. Balt is a bad movie. You can't tell me why Balt's a good movie. He's cool because he doesn't have powers. What type of whack shit is that? He's cool because he doesn't have powers. He doesn't have the powers, not on the level of Lightning McQueen. Give my boy respect. He's cool because he doesn't have powers. Oh, he's just a regular dog. Bro, what in, what in the dumb shit is that? That'd be like watching an anime. That'd be like watching One Punch Man. But instead of One Punch Man being the most powerful superhero, he's just a regular Joe Schmo in, like, the world of superheroes. That would suck. The main character being a, a fucking nobody, being a fucking nobody, and everybody else has superheroes, that's literally Deku. That is literally Deku in MHA. And then he becomes cool because he gets given the coolest power. Imagine MHA. Imagine Deku in MHA never getting All Might's power. That would literally be the worst show ever. <laughs> Yo, that's Bolt. That's why Bolt's a shitty movie. That's, that's why Bolt's a fucking shitty ass movie. Yo, y'all remember how to vote? Yes or no? We gotta have some decisions real quick. <sighs> they they reunited. That's pretty good. Three days later. Buddy's covered in a trash bag. Oh, we're playing Jay now. He dipped on his whole family, Oru, for the sub. He's wanted for the people that don't understand this. This game is in one FPS. Oh my fucking God. Dude, it's like every stream. Oh, yeah. I forgot to do that PSA. This game's art style is kind of like a flip book, right? The game's not lagging, right? It's That's just the style. That's the game itself. Oh, didn't mean to do that. This looks like the saddest bar ever. He can't even drink. Shane, am I drunk? Or are we sitting at a kitty arcade? <laughs> nope. Don't got no space invaders in here. Don't got no space invaders here. We ain't got no... We only got... Oh my god. 
What in the fucking Arkansas country shit? What the hell is that? We ain't got none of that here. Fuck. Order a whiskey? He can't drink. Ask for water, stare them down. Dar for the sub, TJ for the 300 bets. Joe, you don't get to say Bolt is bad when you watch My Hero Academia. My Hero... I didn't connect the Twitch. Yo, L Joe, that's my fault. We for the sub. We were on pause for too long. Oopsies. Oopsies. You're an idiot. Bro, what the fuck? It was because we were on pause talking about Bolt. Dar for the sub. J. John for the three inch events. Bro, My Hero Academia is objectively... You're, t you're telling me you would rather watch Bolt than My Hero Academia. Like, you're actually bugging, bro. You're actually bugging. Like, I understand MHA has a shitty fan community. I do not associate myself with MHA fan communities. However, Bolt is shit. Anything's better than anime. Bro, I have made a full flop, right? Six months ago, I used to say I would never watch anime, and anime was the worst thing ever. Anime's fire. It depends what anime it is that matters. Like, if you're watching those weird-ass schoolgirl volleyball animes, you're fucking weird, right? Like, that's, that's, that's the anime that's weird, right? Like, that's, yo, like, the school anime, yo, that's its own thing, right? MHA, yes, it's based on a school, but it's a school for heroes, right? And they're getting, cool, like, they're getting powerful. That's the whole point. It's not based on, like, a volleyball game and, like, weird-ass close-ups and shit. Like, that's not what that game does. Or not that game, that anime. No one likes anime. See, now that's a shitty thing. You're a weeb. I'm not a weeb. I'm not sitting there trying to learn, like, Japanese from watching the fucking subtitle anime, right? I don't have anime posters and shit. I swear to God, if the boating doesn't work here, I'm gonna freak out. Shane, am I drunk? Or are we sitting at a kitty arcade? Nope. This town ain't no big enough for the both of us. All right, now try it. Easily for the three inch bets. Bolt being a normal dog is what makes him so good. He's only able... Yeah, now it works. He's only able to do everything he does because he believes he's special. I don't care. That's why it's so fire. You have some L takes recently. I'll take a whiskey. MHA... Y'all voted for him to get a whiskey? I wasn't even paying attention. He's 18. He can't drink. They're going to card him. Actually, maybe not because he's in the middle of fucking nowhere. MHA is definitely better than Bolt. But I haven't had some L takes. What other L takes have I fucking had? TJ from the Fringe Bets. I'd rather watch anime like Death Note, Code Geese, <sighs> Monster Attack, or, or Monster Attack on Titan, etc. I watch MHA and I found it so corny. Yeah, the first, no, the first season's eh. Then it gets better. No ice. <laughs> oh, you will, will you? You got ID? Uh, no. I forgot it. Yeah? The classic. And I forgot to serve you. <laughs> Your car break down or something? I just need a ride north. Well, I'm headed south. Try that, fella. <sighs> Bro, this is the saddest bar ever. There's three people here. Now, how's that for dumb luck? Excuse me. Are you headed north? <laughs> Yo, Jay about to get chopped up and thrown in a fucking bag by some serial killer fucking trucker. Excuse me? Excuse me? Are you headed? Are you headed north? I, I really need to go north. Excuse me? Could you perhaps give me a ride? How far? I don't have any money. I don't have an ID on me, and my parents don't know where I am. Oh, so I could chop you up in a bag and throw you in, in, in a ditch, and nobody would know. As far as you'll take me? Fucking idiot. Well, I don't like hitchhikers much, but I'll bite. Who are you running from? And what have you done to piss him off? I actually murdered an entire family. 
Oh shit, 10 is just traveling, 11 is wanted by cops, 12 is none of your business. I know you can't see it, but the, the votings move around. Simone for the 1,100 biddies. I got cheated on, found him, then his best friend texted me asking to take me out to dinner. Then his best friend gave me a, a bear with I'm flowers. The cops. My ex blocked me, but it's okay because he should because I posted pics of me and his best friend on my Insta. Okay, well, you got back at him, I guess. I just wouldn't talk to the best friend solely so you could get back at him. Like, talk to the best friend if you like him, but make sure the best friend likes you too and isn't like your ex. That's what I would say. And thank you for the 1,100 bits. FBI too. <laughs> you told chat. You told him we're running from the FBI. Oh my fucking God. Are you? For what? Not turning in your homework? <laughs> Sorry, kid. I can't get mixed up in it. What if we throw for it? Oh, God damn it. I already knew that was going to happen when each? I saw him playing darts. I win. You give me a ride. If I don't, I'll buy you a drink. You don't have money. Two drinks? Uh, Three drinks. I'm bored. Twenty-seven. Your turn. Yo, darts makes no fucking sense to me. Have y'all ever understood that shit? I don't understand how the points work. Darts have never made sense. Let us cook, Joe. Bro, like, it's not... Oh, do I... hit what I did he hit before. bro hit 18 oh my two. god you're a fucking idiot bro i had that dead center did i not i had that shit dead center but he hit 18 yo you're fucking terrible <laughs> but we're about to lose and i'm gonna have to walk north what do you hit 47 47 Bro, this is fucking insane. How do you hit? I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just shoot that bitch. Now. I think it's predetermined. What's that? 25? Hey, slow down, Robin Hood. I want my free drinks. <laughs> Final round. Stakes are high. Did you hear his Val accent? He had a Val accent. I didn't even pay attention to that. You remember Gabe the Cuck? Yeah, I remember Gabe the Cuck from fucking Ooh. Walking Dead. Hanging in there, though, for now. Bro, this is no the rush, last kid. throw. Hate for you to mess up now. He got those baggy ass pants. Holy shit. Just throw the fucking dart. Damn! You sharking me? I ain't got no patience for sharks. <laughs> I get to go on the hitchhiker ride. Who the fuck is that? Oh, that's... That's one of the girls we held hostage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Yo. What do we do? See why like she's gonna... She... Oh, I remember you. Oh, no, you don't. No, you... No, you don't. I gotta skedaddle. I gotta fucking dip. Yo, he's about to start shitting his pants. Oh, she was one of the cops. Oh, that's even worse. Oh, that's even worse. Oh, my God. I thought she was the lady from the motel. Oh, my God. That's literally one of the cops. Oh, that's even worse. Because she literally you. knows me. I'm looking for an 18-year-old male. Sand-colored hair. Connected to that motel shooting in Two Rock. Who's asking? Someone who was there. Shit. <laughs> Fucking cops. Does this look like a place that serves 18-year-olds? Bro, they know they're talking about me. Are they really about to cover for me after I Go murdered on. someone? I'll keep it busy. Have you seen him or not? His people killed my partner. 
He's going straight to death row. You sure? Death you're row? A you all dress like one. <laughs> I'm off duty. This one's personal. De death row? Yeah, well, I ain't seen anyone. How about you? Seen anyone underage? Zoink, tonight? Scoob. Let's get out of well, here. You look pretty. <laughs> Zoinks. They said they're going to give me the electric chair. Pretty young. <laughs> Just answer the fucking question. What? Bro, I killed like one person. Yo, I'm not saying, yo, like, I thought you had to kill like 40 people to get fucking death row. I mean, I am in like Texas, aren't I? I don't know where the fuck I am. Am I in Arizona or Texas? Okay, let me think. Well, there's Shane at the bar. That big guy, Gene, who comes around for dinner. And Kyle. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe it's Lyle. <laughs> Did you see a teenager or not? Damn, they really covered for no, me. No, can't say I did. But if I do, I'll call you. Or actually, uh, I could just call you anyway. Yo, what is he gonna do when he gets to Canada? Like, <laughs> you motherfucker saying W Riz. Bro, she about to punch him in the face. That is not W Riz. Chip for the sub, TJ for the 300 bits. With what you said Monday about Netflix only be good for originals, I agree. BoJack is pretty good for animation. Uh, the philosophy of that show, I think you like. I've watched some of BoJack. I don't like the animation. Uh, you said you don't like the animation, which I can daft get. Yeah, it just looks, it's like 2D. I don't fuck with it. Fart and bribe for the sub, Jeff for the sub. Uh, all right, drop for the sub too. Motherfucker saying the Rizzly Bear. Jesus Christ. Hey. I am not trusting this man. Is Guess you weren't fucking around back there. Tell me the truth. You kill all those cops? Blow up the school bus? All that shit from TV? I don't want trouble. Shit, kid. You are the trouble. Chat, would you cover for him? Bro, like, this kid comes in, and a cop comes in immediately after, and he's like, yeah, no, a group of, a group of kids murdered, a, a, like, some, some family members, uh, killed a few cops, and blew up a motel. That ain't like, yo, he was speeding. That's like, bro, you actually murdered people. Oh. So did you do it? Damn, chat, fuck. Was it me, or what if I did? Y'all really about to say, wasn't me, chat? He literally just said he was wanted by the FBI. They're not gonna fucking believe- Y'all are dumb as hell. I- yo, 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 thank you. I know I just swayed the shit out of that. I don't give a fuck. Y'all were really about to say, wasn't me. He just told him he was wanted by the FBI. So what if I did? Had a feeling. Summer of 87. A buddy and I rob a grocery store up in Reno. Oh god, he murdered someone too. When the cops find us, I get scared and run. They beat me to an inch of my life. My pal. Black guy named Dave. He, uh, he wasn't so lucky. Damn. Come on. Let's get you north. Al cops. In that situation. In this situation, I think Jay is kind of, you know, uh, guilty of murder. But... I'm going to West Reno. Dude, where the fuck am I... Like, I feel like now we're kind of free in the sense, like, like they're not going to be able to find me as easily since I'm not in the area. Thanks again for the ride. Word to the wise. Hey, lo. Maple for the sub. Uh, root. Bro. Just wanted to send an appreciation gift for you making my day multiple times. Rude Magic 95 
for the $150 fucking dono. Oh my god. Bro, Rude Magic, thank you for the fucking dono. Holy shit. Just wanted to send an appreciation gift for you making my day multiple times. Bro, I am glad that I could make your day. You did not need to send me $150. I'm so happy you sent me $150. But holy shit. Bro. That is a fucking dub. Rude Magic 95, thank you. Genuinely thank you. That is so much fucking money, dude. Cully for the Fringe Bits. Red Notice on Netflix with uh, Ryan Reynolds and Dwayne Johnson is one of the best Netflix originals. I've not seen that. Bro, Rude Magic 95, thank you. Nikki for the Fringe Bits. Holy fucking shit. Dub in the chat for Rude Magic. That is, that is a massive fucking dono. I am glad that I can make your day, and holy fucking shit, thank you for the $150 dono. Gamble that on Red. You see, like, you know, a lot of motherfuckers, a lot of motherfuckers come in my chat and they're like, oh, Joe, when you're 21, you're going to hit a dab card on stream. Oh, you're going to you're going to have a shot on stream when you're 21. Oh, what a bad influence. First off, I am not promoting that shit for people that are not of age and it's not legal in your state for smoking weed. Uh, well, alcohol, you just have to be 21. But still, I'm not promoting that shit unless you're of age. Motherfuckers try to tell me I'm the bad influence. Y'all. Try to get me, yo, y'all literally feed, feed me to get a gambling addiction. Y'all literally try and promote me losing money. Because y'all, like, yo, y'all love when I lose, like, $500 and then I come on stream and just rant about how I lost $500. Like, why the fuck? Like, I, yo, put it, yeah, yeah, Joe, yeah, yeah, no, actually, Joe, 150 on red? I think you gotta do 250 on red. Oh, because it's funny. Bro. I'm literally, next Saturday, next Saturday, I'm probably going to be gambling a bit. Um, I like to celebrate me turning 21. Sunday, I'm betting on the Eagles on the Super Bowl. If both of those days go bad, you will see me in shambles on Monday. Not this Monday, next Monday. If I, if the Eagles lose the Super Bowl, oh my God. The Minecraft Monday stream is 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 gonna be me sitting there fucking crying, like actually just so upset. Fly Eagles, fly! Yeah, bitch, fly Eagles, fly! Because if they fucking lose, oh my god, oh my god! If they lose, oh you will see. I'll be I'll be on fucking Twitter. I'll be fucking on stream. I'll be pissed. I'll be dead pissed. The Chiefs are winning. Oh, bro. If I lose a bunch of money at the casino and I lose a bunch of money uh, fucking betting on the Eagles, oh, it's going to be so upsetting. Oh, it's going to be so upsetting. Neural for the sub. Bro, yo, back to the original point. Rude Magic for the $150 dono. Play the fucking game? I will. Call a friend if you've got one. Yo, this better be a five-hour stream for me to finish this fucking game. Jesus. He barely brought me north. I'm in Utah. That is not that north. Netic for the sub. I still gotta get to Canada. Stream at the casino? I could only... I, I've thought about that. I could stream at the casino if I was doing slots. I can't stream at any of the tables, though. That's what's kind of whack. Like, I couldn't stream me playing blackjack. They would immediately take uh, my camera or whatever I was streaming on. So, no, I'm probably not going to stream at the casino. Just because, like, then I would only be able to play slots. Is it that TOS? No. TOS is online gambling because it's rigged. Um, to a degree. Not, or not, not all online gambling sites are rigged. You have to play online gambling regulated, but you're allowed to stream at a casino. Stake.com. Um, Fuck, what was the other one that Steve Will Do It played on? All of those got banned because those were unregulated. Charge for an 18 year old male wanted in connection to multiple murders at the Desert Green Motel in Arizona. According to inside sources, the district attorney intends to pursue the death penalty. Damn, pursue the death penalty? Yo, he literally just eyed me the fuck down. 
DraftKings is rigged? That's not rigged. That is regulated. DraftKings is an American regulated gambling site. Yo, somebody time out the Link, kid. Yo, Link, I see that you're saying I won the ice cream video. Please stop spamming the fuck out of that. Lucky for the 300 bits. My parents recently got divorced and you helped me through this hard time. Thank you so much. No problem. Uh, and I'm sorry that your parents are getting uh, a divorce or got divorced. Uh, but I'm glad I could help in some way. I need to collect call the Dorland family. Mod scammed us. Er what the fuck are y'all talking about? What's considered non-regulated? All the ones that are like non-regulated gambling is like state.com. Um, it starts with an R. Not, not Rumble. I'm thinking of like the fuck. What is it? Joe, stream already? I am streaming. I don't know. I'm think Rubet. Yeah, Rubet. Rubet is non-regulated. Stakes not regulated. It's ones that are like f based in like foreign countries, and they don't even really have a center of operations. They have like a fake center of operations. And, like, everything is kind of, like, skewed. Uh, black for the 300 bets. Mod scam 90% of us. What happened? With the poll? The poll scammed us. Arizona? I, I just proved to chat how addicted they are to gambling. Wait, what did you do? Did you do a coin flip? Somebody redeemed headset that. Bro, literally. Get scammed, L. They scammed us with a poll. What was the scam? What was the scam? It was worse than a coin flip. The poll had no meaning, yet they still voted on it. It just said slay. It was a prediction? Or a poll? You state your name. State your name, Dean, your study partner, Teddy Roosevelt. 10, 11, or 12. Dean, I think I just called the girl that I was with last stream. Bro, about to say Teddy Roosevelt, the president? The dead president? Oh, my. It's Teddy Roosevelt from history class. Hello? I have a collect call from uh, Teddy Roosevelt. Oh my god. Uh, yes, I accept. I was wondering when you call. Vanessa, I need help. Why? What's wrong? I'm in Utah. I don't have any money. I've barely slept. Ooh, slow down. Damn it, he better ask her to wire him money? Are you in some kind of trouble? Yo, family problems are wanted by the cops. She still doesn't know that I murdered people. Bakey for the sub. How? How? Or not even... I didn't... I Actually, Jay didn't kill anybody. Bro, are, I'm literally vetoing that. I just used my override. And I'm going to pick wanted by the cops. Because I think that... I think he should be honest. I'm picking my override. L chat, the I'm cops, picking my override. They think I did something. I didn't, but... What do they think you did? He thinks they murdered him. He didn't. He was just an accomplice. I was there. I was part of it. But I swear, I, I didn't want to be. I got dragged in. And I got dragged in? It's okay, Dean. And now, and now they're, they're saying they're going to put me on, on death instinct. row? You're not that kind and of all, I, all I want to do is play Fortnite. But, but my mom, my mom. My mom and my older brother, they said they were going to leave me to go to Canada. And all I want to do is play for a night. But I can't because the cops, they're going to, they're going to put me in the electric chair. Listen, look, things have been shitty here too. My dad's convinced you were a drug dealer. He found an old bag of weed in my t-shirt drawer, and now I'm grounded for, like, half the summer. Seriously? I know. He's fucking crazy. Bro, like, he gives a shit about that? I would not care. I would not care. Oh, fuck your dumbass weed problems. I'm on death row. I am a wanted man. What? Easy. 
Fuck your dumbass weed problems. Oh my Holy god. City. Near the. Yo, he dumb as shit. They're probably tracking this. The Sabrina Hotel. Oh my god. Okay, I'll book you a room. You can order room service. Take a nap, and later I'll call to check that you're. Vanessa. <sighs> you know what? I'll meet you there. Wait. Was she better run away too? Oh my god. Don't you have finals? <sighs> Screw finals. I'd rather help a friend. Screw finals. I'd rather start drop shipping. It's not safe. You're awesome. Bakey for the sub. Chat going with you're awesome. Oh god, you guys are literally telling her to give up her life and fucking Holy run shit. from the cops with me. You're awesome. Seriously. <laughs> That's what they tell me. I'll book the room under my name. See you soon. Could could you make sure that the room that the room has good enough Wi-Fi and possibly a flat screen more than 30, 32 inches so I can play Fortnite. Also, could you make sure the pads are separated? Cause you have cooties and I don't wanna, I don't wanna be within six feet of you. <laughs> Bro, meanwhile in Two Rock, Arizona? Where the fuck is this? Oh, this is about to be that dumbass kid that I wanted to get killed. Oh, no, it's not. It's the fucking mechanic guy. Aw, little cat. <laughs> Yo, he looks like the type of guy to say another day, another dollar. Not even in the recyclable spin. Mega cringe. POV you. Regret this. Yo, I don't say another I don't say another day, another dollar. I have said that before. Actually, I have told you guys that I've said that before. I have said that before. Normally I wake up, and every day I wake up, I usually have the thought, like maybe an hour after I wake up, I'm like, wow, I didn't die in my sleep. Like I'm like alive still. Like good shit. <laughs> and then like, and then I just go on with my day. Right? Like, if every day you wake up and you're like, wow, I'm not dead, like, then life just immediately becomes better. Because, like, then you're, like, happy that you didn't die. But right now, you're all I need. I know, Marlon. Two years sober and I can't even fall off the wagon in style. Oh, my God. He's going to start drinking. Don't drink. What's got you so... Oh, God. Who the fuck is in my house? Am I about to play this guy? Hello? Who, who's there? Oh, not the pizza roller. But he grab, grab a knife. Yo, I'm letting the cat investigate that shit. I'll open the door. Swing peek that. Who the fuck? No! Yo, killer! Oh God, Sharon! S -s sorry, sorry. You, you can. Jesus! I finally nod off, and you try to bludgeon me to death. What? She's wanted. Are they together? Why is she there? The... What, you bake now? You broke in to my home. You left the window open. Bike blew a tire the first mile. I lost Tyler. Jay abandoned us. Been scrambling ever since. I just needed some place to rest. Take a shower. 
Yo, I'm immediately ratting on her. I'm immediately ratting on her. There is no fucking doubt. Get the fuck out of my house. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm trying to watch some tunes with my cat. Get dressed. You're leaving. Now. What? Wait, Paul. She about to riz me up. It's already, I already know she about to riz Paul. Uh. That motel, it was the best thing that ever happened to me. And now you and your god... A motel was the best thing that ever happened? Jesus. Damn sons. What we've done is unforgivable. I know. Tell that to Joyce. She lost her home, her livelihood, everything she worked for. Good people died in there. I'm sorry. Truly sorry for what you and that poor family... Can you explain the story one more time? <laughs> yes. Family. Moving because the dad lost their job, right? On the road, they stop at a motel. At that motel, also a family that has just robbed the sheriff. They use that family as hostages. They kill the wife. They leave the motel. Vincent, the dad, and Zoe, the daughter, escape. Boom, they're safe. The rest of the family, including Sharon, which is the, the mother of the, the people that stole money, on the run, they're wanted for death row. Does that make sense? That's literally it. A D cup from 300 bits. Yo, Chin Man, you should play Deep Woken when you get a chance. It's like Heat Rogue, like Deep is calling. That makes no sense. Send that in the game suggestion tab. If you're trying to recommend a game, uh, send it in the game suggestion tab on Discord. Went through. You have to believe me. If I could turn back the clock... You didn't come here to apologize. I didn't know where else to go. Home, the cops, Mexico, I don't care. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't flee to Mexico. Like, why the fuck are they going to Canada? I feel like I would, if you're in, if you're in the South, why would you try to go North? Don't ask me. The, the less I know, the better. Please. I've run out of options. Time was I used to dream of you showing up in my bed. But this, Christ. Look at me. Wow. I've been living like a damn stray. Devastating, Rose. Sleeping in ditches, eating from dumpsters. Last night, some hobo meth head tried to slice my belly with a box cutter. Bullshit, are you hurt? I'm about to, I'm about to, I'm about bullshit. Cat, cat, you're trying to make me feel bad. You're trying to make me feel bad. You're trying to make me feel bad and not, and not, uh, vote for you to die. It's always the same with you. Give Paul a sob story till you get what you want. Well, I'm done. Sob story? You think I do this to myself? It ain't that bad. Sharon, you're all over the news. Tyler. That ain't that bad. I heard they arrested him. Had a busted leg or That's something. That's why he never made it. Bro said it ain't that bad. Bro, she ain't got stitches. That's a, a overreacting much. Acting like, acting like she got her kidney sliced out with a box cutter. You got stabbed. Yeah. But, like, <laughs> you didn't get stabbed that bad. You got, like, kind of stabbed. You got, you didn't get shanked, right? You got, like, sliced. I waited on him as, as long as I could. I, they'll try to break him, but he won't give him the satisfaction. He knows what those sons of bitches did to Dale. My beautiful baby. All his life, they had it in for him. <laughs> Sorry. But, Jay, at least he got away, right? Bro, if I'm them, I'm literally fleeing to Mexico and learning Spanish. Like, I, like, yo, that is actually the only play here. Go to Mexico. Not like, not like a populated city. Go to, like, somewhere kind of in the middle of nowhere, right? Get an okay job. Get an okay job, learn Spanish. Live there for the rest of your life. I don't know life. if he's got the strength to make it. 
I pray he does. It's not the that easy, God, but it's the only answer. Okay. Other than fucking turn yourself in. All but you're on death row. For a few thousand dollars. Just enough to stop those thugs killing us. All because of Bear. Damn him. We both had dreams once, remember? I was going to expand the bar, make it profitable. And what about that coast-to-coast -coast motorcycle trip you always said you were going to do? Is this how you saw your life A turning coast out? A coast-to-coast motorcycle trip is his biggest dream? He could do that right now. He could do that right now. If he really wanted to, yeah, he would miss work and that would be really bad. But, like, bro, like, the gas mileage on motorcycles is very good. He could go coast-to-coast, -coast, not that, not that hard. That's my business. No, it's terrible. Yes, I'm happy here. Damn, he really about to say he's happy here. That's my business. No, it's terrible. Chat with a good vote. Chat with the highest, the best answer possible. W chat. Cam for the sub. I don't go poking around in other people's lives, and neither should you. Facts. How I live is my business. If it makes you happy. Why are you even here? Talking hypotheticals. You're a wanted woman. You gotta leave. Get out of town. You know, Bear always said he'd take me away from Two Rock. Dante loved me for a while, too. Sharon, back then. Oh every... my god, she was like the popular girl in high school. Ain't nobody give a fuck anymore. You're 45. You're 45. Ain't nobody give a shit anymore. You have three kids. This ain't fucking high school. You peaked in high school. Figure it the fuck out. Oh, my God. Oh, back then, everybody wanted you. Oh, my God. Nobody gives a shit. Everyone loved you. You once told me I always choose the wrong guy. Yeah. Well. Yo, she about to say she chose him now. Yo, he's about to fall for that shit, too. I was young and stupid enough to think you'd listen. And I was young and stupid enough to think I knew better. Should have been with you from the start. Oh my god, yo, he, she is literally manipulating him. Yes, you should have. You don't mean that wasn't meant to be. Damn, bro, he better not fall for this shit. She is using him. Oh my god. Yeah, literally about to say, wasn't meant to be. She Then she's going to say, wasn't meant to be. She's going to say, well, we could run away and, and start a life together. It Fuck you, Sharon. Don't be so and sure. And for the sub. You've always been a good friend. When those thugs showed up at our door, when I had no one else to turn to, you were the one who stepped up. Yo, she now, to wait if a she minute. If she tried to kiss me, I'd punch her if, in the face. If you're talking about... You knew we were sinking. But coming up with the code to Dante's safe, that was... It... He's in, he was in on it! He was in on it! Nah, what is Dante safe? That's the, pe that's the people they robbed. That's how all this started. They went to the sheriff's house and robbed the sheriff. Bro, I was wondering how they got the fucking code. He was the one that got it. How the fuck did he even get it? Some for the subs, half for the three inch bets. Love the stream. This is my third uh, one I've been following on YouTube and TikTok. Love the content. Thank you. Um, and welcome to the stream, even though you've kind of been here to other streams. If I'd known what would... Oh, Jesus. I'd never have given... Oh, God. Oh, hell. I think we could both use a drink. Don't you? Damn, she's trying to make me go she's trying to make me go back to being an alcoholic. Fuck you, Sharon. Fuck you, Sharon. He's two years sober. He is two years sober. I am not taking that shit. Not for the sub. No. No. Two years sober. Fuck you, Sharon. It's different when it's like a casual drink, but if he was an alcoholic, he should not start drinking again. He's gonna go back down the path. Refuse drink. Refuse drink. Good shit, chat. 
Every part of me is screaming, yes. But if I taste one sip of that... Paul, I'm so sorry. That was... <sighs> I should have known better. Yo, fuck Sharon. Actually, fuck Sharon. Look, I am punching her in the face. Nobody knows your part in this. And I swear, it'll stay that way. But... And I hate saying this. Yo, she better blackmail me. I need your help. You're blackmailing me? <laughs> Yo, literally. Not after last time sounds ominous. What's in it for me? Bro, like she's actually blackmailing me. She's like, I, uh, I won't tell anybody, but I need your help. So she's insinuating that if I don't help her, she's going to fucking rat on me. Or what? You're going to tell the cops? No, I wouldn't betray a friend. I mean, sure. You could end up in jail because of all this. <laughs> what? And so could I. Yo, she is. So could you. You're wanted. You're wanted. What do you mean, so could you? You're going to. You. The FBI is after you. But there's a way out. Oh my God. I'm us. fucking timing this kid out that's telling me to shut the fuck up. Cam, you've typed that shit fucking 35 times. Mods, time Cam, Cam J out for like literally 20 minutes. More than that. That's fucking annoying the shit out of me. Saints for the 300 vets. That book of his? I looked a bit closer. It's not just bribes. Dante's been taking money from criminals and funneling it into a single offshore account. Yo, how many shots has she taken? That was just his cut. The real money's in a bank in Belize. And the details are right here. Oh my god, smoking a ciggy too? Jesus Christ. No name, no ID. All a person's gotta do is walk in, hand over the password, and walk out with the money. Can't be me. They catch one whiff of me and I'm locked up for life, but you. Then we expose Dante for what he is. Karma. Payback, call it what you like. And by the time his world crumbles, We'll be long gone. Yo, Mots! Time him out! He's still typing it! Please! Six inch for the sub. Look, you say us being together Alright, my mods aren't doing it. You did? No, you didn't, because he's still spamming it. He's still spamming it. Cam JR, you timed out the wrong kid. He's typed it like 45 times now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Literal L chatter moment. L chatter moment. Not gonna ban you, but I'm timing you out for a fucking week, dude. Jesus Christ. Ban evasion, too. Holy shit. Holy shit. L chatter, and then he put bro. Bro, you're the one that keeps typing it. You've typed it like 45 times. Holy shit. My chat's laggy as fuck, too. All right. It's meant to be. But I say still this typing is our it. chance to change that. You can stay here in Two Rock and drink yourself into oblivion. Or we can live together in paradise. You do realize if we do this... Yo, she's literally manipulating me. You'll never be able to see Jay again. That doesn't mean I can't help him. At some point, I'll find a way. Nah, she's, she didn't even want to help months. Jay. She said she was going to let Jay turn. fucking die. Come with me. Kiss! Yo! Reject or kiss? Yo, I'm about to, yo, y'all, good shit, chat. We about to dub her. Fuck you. Fuck you. Please, Paul, just listen to me. I've listened, but the answer is no. I can't do it. Who the hell's here? Somebody's outside. Oh, no. Oh, it's the cops. Expecting anyone? No. Hey, cuz, it's me. <laughs> Open up. Oh my Shit. god, it's literally it's the sheriff. Game. Bro, are they cousins? He said, hey, cuz. Wow, this is the saddest hotel ever. Holy shit. Uh, Do not like the floor plan here. Uh, fancy seeing you here. Hey, can I ask why she's still in her school uniform? Like, she just traveled, like, what, three states? 
Nice disguise. You actually came. Did you tell anybody? Like, what the fuck? Six inch for the sub. What are y'all about to say? You actually came. Nice disguise, too, is also a good one. Oh. Nice disguise. Hey. Cool outfit. Uh, yeah, right. I was so busy packing for the road that I forgot what I was wearing. How did she get here? Can I come in? <sighs> I thought you wanted to sleep. I didn't want them to have to make the bed. I took $200 from my dad's emergency. That's their job! What? Fund. I also brought you a change of clothes. And tomorrow morning, I can drive you to the bus station and get you a ticket to wherever you want. And then we're even. Okay? Even? You don't owe me anything. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm pretty sure I aced my history final. Acing a history final with the help of, like, 20 minutes of studying. Paying for somebody's hotel. Being an accomplice to the fact that they're running from the cops and the FBI. Buying them a bus ticket. Giving them $200. Yeah, I would say that's pretty even. I would say, that, I, I, I would say that's pretty square. I would say that's pretty square. Acing the test. Being an accomplice to somebody who's wanted on death row. Yeah. I don't deserve this. You're really kind. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. You about to guilt trip the shit out of her. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve any of this. Damn. Damn. That was almost a I, fucking even vote. Nobody's ever done something like this for me. I don't deserve it. Of course you do. Why? Look... If someone accused me of something I didn't do, my brother would have been right there in my corner. Well, he did do it. But when he was in trouble, I couldn't help him. So, if I can help you somehow, what's wrong? Well, okay, he did do it and he didn't do it, right? He didn't kill anybody. So him being on death row is kind of stupid, right? He never murdered anyone. But... He did rob the sheriff, did hold people hostage, did run from the cops, is trying to actively evade the FBI and flee to Canada. So that is kind of like what? Like a 20, 30 year sentence, but it's not death row. It's just, if you hadn't come. The brother killed like three I people. Have nobody now. Can you go to your family? To your mom, maybe? She ain't my mom. And my brothers ain't my brothers. They told me the night I met you. Yo, he looks like he smells like cheese puffs. Was some aunt. I don't know who my dad was. Oh, Dean. Like genuinely. I feel terrible. I feel lost. They betrayed me and can't process it. You random as fuck, dude. It's just the face that he's making. Like, bro, you're telling me that's not cheese puff face? Like, yeah, <laughs> like, like his favorite snack is that fucking big ass tub of those cheese balls. That's what he's eating. You know, like, if he if he goes to Walmart, that's the first thing he's years. buying. That's what's going in the cart. Families are pretty good at that. Mine always was, anyway. Maybe from now on, families are the corn people ball. you born Yo, with. literally. Maybe it's the people you choose. I saw that on a t-shirt. <laughs> it's a good t-shirt. Mm -hmm. That's not your room. Like hell it's not. My daughter's in there. Oh my god. Gulp. How did he find me? Gulp. See this? That's my credit card that she needs to book this room. Now, open the door or I'm calling the police. She was followed. Dad? What are you doing? Who else is here? Did you fucking follow me? How did you, you think I don't get a fraud alert when someone uses my card out of state? Yo, is he standing on the is ledge? Nah! Nah! I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. Nope. 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 I'm literally just gonna deck the dad and run out, bro. If it came, if it came down to that, yo, you're fucking bugging. Somebody said jump off. They're four stories up. He would die. Diddy Hotel. It's none of your business. What are you doing? 
Oh, nah, but he's getting actually shimmied over to the fire escape. Um, yo, my legs would be shaken. What if I didn't tap? He would have just fell to his death. Vanessa, do you want to turn out like your brother? Living a secret life? Lying all the time? Until some cold morning you're wheeled into a morgue? Oh, sure, let's- You smoked weed, Vanessa! The devil's lettuce! You might always, you might already be a crackhead for all I know. My God! <sighs> Blame him for his death. He was hit by a drunk driver. At four in the morning, with enough shit in his system to kill him. You know what? No, I'm not doing this. You're coming home, and that's that. Well, can I at least pee first? Oh, do what you have to. Uh, Yo, she gave him that fucking dead stare. <laughs> How the hell did she know he was over there? It's a window. It's not. It's not a fucking what cinder doing? block, buddy. What does it look like I'm doing? What's going on in there? Why is she running from her dad? Her life isn't bad. Her life is not bad, right? Like, yeah, I get it. Her dad's a bit of a dick. But, like, she has a nice house. She's kind of set up for life. Like, oh, my God, bro. She's really about to run away from that shit. Hurry. Yo, she, like, I understand why he's running. She's just dumb as hell. You. Yo, fuck you, big ears. Fuck you, big ears. Get the fuck out of here. About to flip him off and run away. Some people aren't allowed to have boyfriends. Not allow it not allowed to have a boyfriend? Running away from your home and being an accomplice to somebody who's wanted by the FBI. Dealing with the fact that your dad doesn't want you to have a boyfriend? Running away from home and being an accomplice to somebody who literally held people hostage. I don't really know. Right. And Vol for the three inch bits. I just wanna uh I just want you to know you make my day and help me uh get on a better mood. Thank you. Uh and I'm glad that I can help your mood when you're feeling down. Vanessa! You're making a huge mistake! Yo, he really lost them that fast. How the hell did he get down there that quick? We need to get out of here. You mean together? I'm not just going to abandon you. She knows nothing about him. She thinks his Don't name I is Dean. She thinks his... She doesn't even know his real name. And she's fucking... She doesn't even know his last name. Yo, my name's Dean. She's called him as Teddy Roosevelt. Yo, this girl is bugging. He could be a serial killer. How to start a car without the key? You mean hotwire it? Dale showed me once. different but I think it's these ones he just gets electrocuted damn oh my god got me working for that shit Yeah, let's, let's, just, let's just reverse full speed into oncoming traffic in a fucking intersection. What a great play that is. You would have immediately gotten hit by a car. Vanessa! It can't be. 911, what's your emergency? This is gonna sound crazy. <laughs> But I think my daughter just ran off with a fugitive. Yo, I'm saying that right now, though. If I had that motherfucker's hairline, I'm shaving my head. Like, the second it's all the way back where my headset is, bro, it's done. It's so over for. Her. 
The Goodman line? Bro, he literally has the Goodman haircut. Saul's haircut. It's already that bad. Bro, no, it's not. Literally, no, it's not. Like, y'all y'all literally just try to piss me off. Like, it, yo, like, I gotta, oh my god, dude. I feel like it is receding. I feel like it is receding. I don't know. I think I'm just convincing myself of that. Yo, Chad, should I get a new haircut on Friday? I'm getting a haircut Friday. I'm thinking that I might, I might switch it up a bit. I might try, okay, look. Hear me out, chat, right? When you look at, and, and ignore the headset then, but when you look at my hair, you see how this side goes like this, and then this side goes down? What about both sides going like this? Kind of like a, a faux hawk. Not like a mohawk, but kind of like a faux hawk, you know what I mean? Get a carrot top cut? I'm not getting the carrot top cut again. I will never get that carrot top cut again. If I ever have that carrot top, like, if I ever went to, to the fucking barbers and they gave me that shit again, I'm wearing a beanie for fucking three weeks. I'm, yo. What haircut should I get? I'm trying to switch it up. I, I, I might just get it cut shorter just because this part's kind of annoying me right now. But, like, I don't know, dude. Get dreads. Yeah, what a great idea. I wouldn't look dumb as fuck with dreads. Carry for the sub. Get a fade? That's just the side of your hair. Saying get a fade doesn't mean what haircut you're going to get. Grow it out? I'm not growing it out, Marbro. Fucking. Thanks for taking over. I told you it's cool. I love driving. Do they know where they're going? I should have done this ages ago. Run away from home. All right, all right. Now let's pan it out here. You ran away from home. Uh, how are you going to get money? How are you going to get a job? How are you going to get a home? How are you going to evade the police? How are you going to get into Canada and live in Canada illegally because you're not actually going to go there and get a citizenship or uh, you don't even have your passport on you? So you're just going to kind of flee to another country illegally, right? How are you going to do this? This is great. We got to be careful. How do you vote? You just have to type uh, hashtag and whatever number you want to vote for, right? So like hashtag one, hashtag two. Sometimes it'll be different numbers, peeled. though. Your dad's going to be looking for you. He didn't see the car, and it'll be a while before anyone reports it stolen. Henry so for the fringe bets. If you get really a buzz going... cut, I will buzz off my hair. Dude, I would look so bad with a buzz cut without a beard. Dude, a buzz cut, I would look. You sound like a parent. I sound like a parent. Buddy, I'm just being logical. You run away from home. You haven't even graduated high school yet. How are you even even if you even if you run away from home and and you're not fleeing somebody you're you're not fleeing with somebody that's wanted by the FBI. How are you getting a job? Right? How are you doing anything? You don't have any inf you don't have your passport. You don't have any fucking shit you need. You just left the home with a backpack and clothes. That's not going to work. Right? You got to go to the DMV. You're going to have to get your fucking uh, birth certificate. You're going to have to get a copy of your driver's license. You're going to have to get everything. Right? You don't have that. Now, but what haircut should I get, chat? We're doing a pause here. I don't care if this is going to be a fucking five-hour stream. We're doing a pause here, chat. What haircut should I get? Haircuts for blonde men. Bro, because, like, some haircuts, like, aren't, like, wouldn't work. For like oh yo okay like some haircuts look kind of fire but like some get a perm i'm just simply not getting a perm bro get a high fade bro for the people saying mullet y'all are actually pissing me off like y'all are like you know i'm not gonna rock a mullet bro i wouldn't even be able to rock a mullet that just wouldn't work uh kind of like this on both sides like a symmetrical cut like this, but not as, not like as like mohawky. You know what I mean? Like longer in the back. Like very similar to what I have now, but like this part would also be going this way. So it would kind of literally just be like, like up. 
Like, no, no, fro. Okay, okay, y'all don't fuck with that. Y'all don't fuck with that. Get the Edgar cut. Chat, if I really pulled up, if I pulled up to stream on Friday like that, would y'all be like, oh my god? Like, I feel like some of y'all would actually just be like, yeah, that's fire. Like, you would just lie. Yo, that's fire, Joe, no lie. Really fuck with the haircut, man. That shit looks so dope. That shit looks so dope, Joe. Yeah, I really fuck with it. Fucking pissing me off. Uh, yo, I don't know, maybe like, if I wanted to grow it out, like, there's options, right? Like, if I wanted to grow it out, I could rock something that's kind of like this, right? Like, it, and just kind of have the swoosh more in the front, longer on the sides and shit. I could also run something that's similar to this, right? Like, it's kind of something that I already have. I don't want to switch it up too much, but, like, something where it's, like, not, like, I don't know, dude. Like, I don't know. Like, when my shit grows out like this, it pisses me off. Like, I want to grow out my hair, but I have to, like, start it at a, at a different point. I, and I feel like I got to style it better. Or like this. Oh, fuck. Like this. Dude. Oh, my God. I don't know. There's too many fucking options. See, like, I don't know what I could even rock with my hair, bro. Like, this is good. Like, that's good. Like, this is also, like, okay, but I kind of, I, that would not fit me. I would look like a douchebag, so that one's no. This one could also work, but I would have to grow up my hair so much. The ice spice cut. Bro, like, I don't know. What is R9? What is R9? R9 haircut. What does that even mean? Bro, like, that's actually a haircut? Oh, my God. That looks bad. That looks really bad. That looks really bad. Oh, my God. Yo! The buzz would look fire, Loki. Bro, w but stream I always appreciate look at, the yo, chat, topic, rants and chat, 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 chat. Imagine I have a buzz cut, right? Just look at me. Just <laughs> yo, just look at me. <clears throat> yo, neural statue for the fucking ten thousand biddies. Look at me. Buzz cut. But not like, not like, not like a, not like a, like a short buzz, like kind of a longer buzz, right? A buzz, you look silly as hell. Oh my, I feel like, yo, y'all are imagining that a buzz would look like, ugh, like y'all are imagining this is my buzz, right? Or like some Ryan, not like, yeah, some like Ryan Gosling shit. I feel like y'all are imagining this is me with a buzz. In reality, this is going to be me with a buzz, right? In reality, I'm going to be out there looking like Eminem. Like, I'm going to be, this is be, this about to be Joe Bart with a buzz. I need to grow a beard if I get a buzz. Like, I would need a long buzz, maybe. But, like, realistically, that shit would look whack. XD for the 300 bits, bro. And Neural, Neural Statue fucking 872. Eight, Thank you for the 10,000 bitties, bro. The buzz would look fire. I don't think it would. Get Frosted Tips. Henry for the 300 bits. Uh, Hip for the 300 bits. Uh, Chico for the sub and Henry for the 300 bits. If you get a buzz cut, I would get one. Bro, I feel, I feel like I would just look dick. I would look so bad with a buzz cut. Pompadour cut. See, like, that's a genuine recommendation. Like, W... Oh. Ooh. See, nah. See that? Like, the Ludwig cut. Like, that works on Ludwig. I don't style my hair, bro. Like, Ludwig works on his hair... I ain't got the time to fucking do that shit, right? I wake up and I just go, and then I leave, right? Like, I need some shit that takes 10 seconds. 
Bendy for the three inch events. If you get an Edgar hut, uh, cut, Brooke would propose. Should I should I uh, text Brooke and ask her if she would be okay if I got a buzz cut? Would I look bad with a long buzz cut? Yo, she about to say fuck no. She about to say fuck no. Don't get that shit. Because Brooke likes when I have long hair, but I also think like, I don't know. She did say if I had a beard, I would look good with a buzz cut. All right, I got to go run to the bathroom real quick. I'm going to play some music. And I'll be back in like 30 seconds. Wait a minute, oh, man. man. Hey, man, check it out, it. man. Tell it, man. It was this blind man, right? Tell it out, man. It was this blind man, right? He was feeling his way down the street with this stick, right? Yeah. Hey, he walked past this fish market. You know what I'm saying? Fish market. He stopped. He took a deep breath. He said, Woo! Good morning, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> you like that shit, man? I'm pretty good. Hey, man, I got a gang of that shit, man. Hey, you I, I tell you what, man. my man on the guitar. Hey, pull on the drum. Hey, just, hey, everybody just crowd around the mic. I tell you all these motherfucking hey, jokes hey, I got. Hey, this is the first I'm gonna start off like this. Hey, help me sing it, homeboy. Come on. Say code 45 and two zigzags. Baby, that's all we need. We can go to the park after dark. Smoke that tumbleweed. As the marijuana burn, we can take our turn. Singing them dirty rap songs. Stop and hit the ball like Cheech and Chong. It still takes from here to Hong Kong. So roll. Roll my joint, pick out the seeds and stems. Feeling high as hell, flying through palm dale, skating on dragon rims. So roll, like roll the '83 Cadillac. I feel like I feel like the issue. If I got a buzz, I was thinking about this while I was taking a piss. I I feel like the issue. If I got a buzz chat, would I? My forehead would be much more dominant. Like it, yo, it's already big. If I got a buzz, it's gonna be it's gonna it's gonna be like that, right? Oh Jesus, dude! Like that. I dude, I feel like I'm just gonna not like it. Like I yo chat, would that be bad? I'd be looking like Mega Mind. Yo, Dylan for the five inch bits says get the vanilla ice haircut. Bro, no. Uh, Dylan for the five inch bitties. And again, bro, um, Neural, thank you for the 10,000 bitties, dude. Jay Dens for the 300 bits. I have 26 followers on Twitch. It would make my day if you say W Jaden. Why are you telling me how many followers you have on Twitch? Um, and Chico for the 300 bits. Joe, you look like Johnny Sins if he had hair. Fuck. Chat, would I look bad with a buzz cut? Wait, Brooke just texted me. I don't think you should get a buzz cut. When you're 30 with a beard, it would look good. Right now, it would look bad. Facts. Fuck. When I'm like, yeah, when I'm like 30 and I have kids, that's the, that, that would be different. They got more protected lands than all 50 states combined. Wait, hold up. I got to put the game capture back on. Bink. Do you remember? I can fish, hike, live in the forest. Only thing is, how to get in. Well, my brother had a friend who moved to Idaho Falls. I bet he'd help us with gas money. Plus, he's really good with fake IDs. She, she, L. Brooke? Yo, y'all saying L. Brooke, but she's being real, bro. Like, y'all are just trying to egg me on to get a shitty haircut so you can make fun of me. Because that's what you guys do. Idaho? That's a long way for you. I've got all weekend. We can stop in time for some clothes and call Todd from a payphone. Could you hand me my cigarettes? Uh -huh. Get the Jalen Hurts haircut. Yo, last haircut I'm looking up. I don't even know what Jalen Hurts haircut looks like because he's always wearing a football helmet. But he's got a buzz. He's got a short buzz. But he has a small forehead, so it works. My shit, it would not work. Actually, he has a big forehead. See, his... Oh, fuck. Bro, it's just my hairline's so high up. Like, I feel like I would look dumb as hell. My God. Yo! No! I wish my mom had done this. 
spread her wings before she couldn't anymore. What happened to her? Officially, the big C in her pancreas. Oh, God. The doctor said it was just bad Smoking luck. Smoking a cigarette? I say it's what happens Ugh. when you spend your life doing what someone tells you instead of standing up for who you are. Your dad? He was tough on her? On all of us. I still can't believe he followed me to Utah. Ugh. Bro, cigarettes are so nasty. He doesn't know you. He's worried. He's terrifying. They're talking about the dad. 10, 11, or 12. Henry from 300 Bits, you missed my last dono. What do I have to do for you get a, to get a buzz? Bro, I don't know. I would maybe do like a wager one day with a charity event. Like if we raise a certain amount of money, I would get a buzz. But that would be the only time. Like I wouldn't want to just get a buzz to get a buzz. This way. You know what I mean? No. He wants to be in control. Like maybe one of the charity streams we do. You know what? I, you know how I do charity streams like every other month? Like w one charity stream I would do like, hey, if we raise like 5K, I'd shave my head. Like, that would be, like, I would do that. I would do that. Maybe. Maybe. Not a guarantee, though. He thinks I have the same shitty judgment my brother did. Do you? <laughs> French crop taper fade. Why is everybody saying that? French crop taper fade. Yo, after this, fuck off with... Bro, this is literally the Edgar cut. It's like a, sh a less shitty Edgar cut. Bro. Like, yeah, okay. We're done with the haircut shit. Stop talking about haircuts. I'm doing this, aren't I? I'll tell you one thing. He must be flipping his fucking lid right now. His little girl stealing a car. Yo, What's she's, she's pulling that sick. She's like halfway through. You're done in your life. What's the worst thing I've ever done? Lie to a girl I like the burglary, leaving without saying goodbye. He buried a dead body. That's the worst thing he's done. Leaving without saying goodbye, lying to a girl I like the burglary. Bro, none of these options are are fucking right. He buried it. He killed somebody. He did kill Probably. someone! Oh my god, I forgot that about that. Oh you. my god, Jay actually did kill somebody. He buried a guy alive. Your belt. Right. Your big crime. What were you Wait, no, he didn't. No, he didn't. The dad did. He's trying to steal Damn. anyway. Money. That's it? Not like some Picasso or a plasma TV? They didn't need a TV. They needed cash. Brother's friend. Huh? Do you really think he'll help me? <laughs> I never said he'd help you, but he'll help me. <laughs> There's no way they hear each other. Facts, because you're in a I fucking top-down oh, no. car. Oh, we're back if here. He finds me, we're both fucked. Tell him to go away. Stall him. Anything. I'm literally ratting on her. Oh, what's up, Dante? You looking for Sharon? Come back later. I'm sick. Just a minute. Say nothing. Damn. Well, I can't rat yet. None of these are rats. I'm sick is a dumbass fucking excuse. Just a minute. Yeah, you gotta answer it. You can't not say anything. The fucking car's outside. Good answer, chat. Be right there. Hurry up and stop playing with yourself. What the fuck? <sighs> what do I do? Hide bra, hide porn mag, hide cigarette, hide glasses. Is there anything else? Scanning, 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 scanning. Uh, hide the bra! Why are y'all not voting that? Good shit. Damn. Oh my god. Motherfuckers are saying hide the porn mag. Like he's gonna give a shit about that. Fuck. Hide cigarette. Hide glasses. Hide glasses. Hide glasses is the better one. 
Hide porn mag, no. Cigarette, whatever. He smokes cigarettes. There's multiple glasses, so you would see that there's multiple people there. You want to know that it's just you alone. And he stopped drinking, so. Ain't waiting out here like a prick. Get your pants on. I'm coming in. Right, he about to break in. Just open the fucking door. Sorry. Hi. I, uh... What's with the kitty bike out front? Yeah. Just fixing it up for Joyce's kid. Not much, but after what he's been through. Right. Got some of your stuff they say from the fire. Tools and whatnot. I thought you might need them. Uh, thanks. Jeez. <laughs> it's darker than a dungeon in here. Look, uh, didn't mean for that to become such a clusterfuck. Holtz opened a big can of worms when they stole from me. If I don't get everything back, well, I'm just as screwed as they are. So Joe, you keep rigging the votes. Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop sharing what I want you guys to vote for. You got any uh, plans now that the motel's gone? Or are you just going to shut yourself away forever like Grandma did? Take a vacation, no plans, maybe a bank heist, find a new job. They're asking what he's going to do. I'm not going to share my opinion. It's just his opinion, yeah, but my opinion does sway some votes. Probably rob a bank. Because <laughs> you couldn't hold up traffic. Yeah. Oh, look at this little man-eater. If my Aunt Cletus gets a whiff of you, oh boy, me will be in the doghouse, huh? Well, you look like I feel. <laughs> uh, Bet we could both use a coffee, right? Uh -huh. Sit down, I get it. When I first joined the department, Sheriff Wilson assigned me coffee duty. Had to make a pot every morning. Oh, that guy was fucking picky. Yo, he is already acting so fucking sus. He's just like skit. Oh god, the cigarette. Yeah. Back then, I believed it was about making. Wait, does a does he not smoke cigs? He could just say he started but smoking cigs. Being a good guy ain't always so simple. Because when you got some crazy asshole and you can't tell if he's holding a Bible or gun what do you do ow hmm? uh -huh. what the fuck answer question hide cigarette mm, answer the question or hide cigarette i feel like either way if you answer the question he might find the cigarette you hide the cigarette he's gonna be around you answering the fucking question didn't share my opinion there gave an answer for both Go with your gut feeling. That's all anyone can do. Well, like Shut up, always... Joe. You're rigging it. I'm timing you out for the rest of the stream. I'm so sorry. You're pissing me off. I'm so sorry. I didn't rig the vote there at all. I didn't rig. I didn't rig the vote there at all, brother. You know I didn't too. You're just trying to be a dick. All right. Actually, I'll time you out for ten minutes. You can come back after this conversation. You can stand in the corner for ten minutes. Hey, I'd rather wind up standing in a courtroom than lying in a coffin. Or better yet, everyone just get the fuck out of my ass and let me do my job. If I don't share my opinion, I'm sitting here dead silent. Like, I can't talk. Like, you guys vote, but you don't have to vote so, for what I'm telling you I would do. Told me like, then I'm just sitting here familiar. like... Like, Talk not, not saying office. anything. That's just weird. Just, you know, asking what I could remember about uh, about the motel and all that stuff with, uh, with the bus. They wanted your opinion on whether I'd lost my damn mind, didn't they? It was a lot of questions. I, I can't... Uh -huh. And what was your professional opinion? They ended the standoff. You went too far. 
I don't really have an opinion on this one. It's not that I don't want to. Either way, it's bad. You ended the standoff as a compliment, but it's like it's like fucking dick riding. You went too far. It's just gonna piss him off. I feel like being more honest though, just so he knows some sort of inkling on why I'm being weird. I said maybe in hindsight you, you could have handled things differently. But Dante, you gotta understand. Oh, I understand perfectly. I'm sure you told them exactly what they wanted to hear, didn't you? Those bastards were about to head to Mexico. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. Sharon's dumb as shit. I've Sharon, just hop something. out the window, you idiot. Why are you trying to run out the front door? Now the whole thing's turned into a pissing match over jurisdiction. Goddamn FBI involved. Even Becky hates my guts. Who the hell's those Becky? Boys are blessing when they broke into my house. You know that? Oh. Yeah, I'll do my best by her, but I guess it'll never be enough. Hmm? Uh-oh. You know you smoke menthols? Uh, oh, I just started. Trying to quit. You know how hard it is, though. Yeah. Well, yeah. once you let a bad thing get its hooks into you, it'll never let go. Somebody said, BK asked for the 300 bits. Screw that, cuck. Speak your mind. Yeah, I'm gonna, bro, like, yo, this is what I'm gonna say, right? When I share my opinion for what I would do, don't vote accordingly, right? You're allowed to vote however you want to vote. If you fuck up the vote and you do something that I wouldn't do, whatever, right? That's the point of the game. Miss For the $50 fucking dono. Hope this dono goes through. Keep up W stream. Duh. Almost at my six month sub mark W. Almost at the six month sub. New sub badge coming in soon. Missed Spider Man. Thank you for the $50 fucking dono. Dub for that. Thank you for the dono. And thank you for almost being a six month sub. I appreciate the fucking dono. Gabe for the sub as well. Wait, I got to turn off. All right, there it is. Thank you for the $50, though, Mr. Spider Man. Massive dub for that. I appreciate it. Did you turn on the lava lamp? I did. I remembered to turn on the lava lamp before stream, so now it's actually working. Look at it. How cool. I really got to get a fish tank or some shit. I hope it falls over. Okay, asshat. Again, though, Miss Spider-Man, think of the $50 dono. Massive dub for that. Oh, God, the cat's going to fucking ruin it. This is so awkward. Say, I never thanked you for getting me a discount on that office safe. It's the same model they put in the rooms at the motel, right? Oh, that's why he knew. That's right. Oh, he's going to catch on. That's funny. <laughs> After those old boys broke in, I, uh, I found a slip of paper with some numbers on it. Now, how do you think they knew about that factory override? Uh-oh. A lucky guess. You think it's me? You wrote it down? Oh, my God. I would say you wrote it down. You think it's me? Bro, then he's immediate. Oh, my God. He's... You're not pointing a finger at me, are you? Dante, we're family. Oh, sure. Blood's thicker than water. Yeah, but one thing... That was a... See, yo, good shit, chat. I appreciate y'all voting how you think you should vote. But I'm going to say, that was the dumbass answer. Right? That was the dumbass answer. Bro... That's not, ga yo, gaslighting him is a terrible thing to do. Because if he immediately says, oh, you're accusing me, that makes him seem sus. Sure. Wherever Sharon Holt is, she ain't sipping margaritas on some tropical beach. Nope. In fact, I don't think she got too far at all. You know, I forgot how close you two used to be. I seen as we're family. I'm gonna make this real easy for you. Where is she? Oh God, how the hell does she know? She's gone, she's here. Fuck. Bro, she got that book though. Like, if Dante was just a regular sheriff, I would rat. Bro, y'all really about to say she's here. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, chat. This is about to escalate real fast. Metal for the sub, agent for the sub. Yeah, I wouldn't say she's here. She's, she's. In the 
Is she still in here? Is she about to laugh? Oh, they're about to fight. Oh, he got a gun too? Oh, nah. This is about to be a shootout. You murdered my son! <laughs> World you star! World star! Start filming it! Start filming you it! ain't going anywhere. I'm taking you in to answer for what you've done. You and me both know that's not why you're taking me in. No. Nuh uh. Don't even start down that road. Paul, oh, come with me. It's not too late. He's gonna kill one of them right now. No doubt Dante safe. kills them. The same model you put in the motel rooms. Gave her the factory code. Where's my book? You have it. I know you do. And you ain't getting it. If I don't, I'm finished. Don't worry. I'll make sure all. Why would you tell them that? Why would you tell them that? If you don't give me the book, I'm really fucked. That only gives them more power. If you, if you, yo, 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 uh, Sharon, if you give them the book, that's really gonna fuck me over. Like. You got to be nonchalant. You got to be like, yeah, if you give them the book, so what? Papers get a copy as soon as I've emptied the account. These people, you don't know who you're dealing with. Oh, no. Don't you understand? It's not my money. Paul, oh, how could you do Hey, Joe, I, yeah, I don't know if there's mods here, but there's a chatter named that that's being really racist. I, dude, I don't know if my mods are here. There's always mods here. It's just like sometimes they're just not paying attention. They're said, okay, yeah, no, there's manifest is here. It's like, yo, and then my chat's laggy as shit. Manny's here. I don't know any other fucking mods that are here. Yeah, there's like no mods here. What the fuck? OFS. I'll literally look. There's like not that many mods. All right. Yo, ban this chatter. Wait, what did they say? Oh, yeah, they said the N-word. Yup, yup, yup. Well, they, th they said rig. And then somebody said, y'all dick ride Joe. How do they, how do, uh, brother's saying y'all dick ride Joe. I'm saying L chatter because somebody's racist. That's not dick riding. That's literally saying L chatter because somebody's tried to say the N-word. What? Listen to me. You deserve it. You can keep the book. I would not give him the book. I would say you deserve it. Paul, how could you do this to me? You could keep the book. No, he can't. You give him the book, you have no fucking leeway. He could just shoot you in the face. I know where that money comes from. Sharon told me everything. You don't know the half of it. And you take her side over mine? Your own blood? Oh, they actually are cousins. I know she made you do this, Paul. <sighs> Look. I'm giving you a get out of jail card here. Now give me the gun. After Nam, I swore I'd never hold one again. You know that. Don't give me that flower power crap. Just give me the gun. If you listen to him, you're a fool. He'll put us both away. Oh, God. Help Sharon or help Dante. Fuck! Yo, I don't know. I literally don't know. I literally don't know. I, I, bro, y'all really about to say help Dante because he said the get out of jail free card. <gasps> yeah, fuck Sharon. Actually, fuck Sharon. Even though Dante's uh, a little weasel, yo, Sharon's actually trying to use me. Yep. I'm down for that. Oh, shit. No, no, no. Shoot her. Shoot her. You used me once. I'm not going to make the same mistake again, Sharon. We both know it's over. Star-crossed lovers. It would never work, Sharon, and you knew it. <laughs> after after Junior Prom, you after you, you you poured the punch on my face, I knew we would never be together. <sighs> Fucking shut up. Damn. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sharon. I didn't want anyone else getting hurt. You included. F. You did the right thing. Does she even have the book on her? 
So now Dante just got away with whatever the fuck it was. Ooh, snatch that book. Hey, snatch Jared, that book. Your whole boy turned up in Utah with some girl in tow. FBI ripped the suit. Out. Oh, they're all about to get caught. I feel like the only person I want to get away is Jay. All the other people I don't really give a fuck about. Uh, Dark for the 500 bets. Uh, High for the 300 bets. Screw Sharon, I'm throwing her under the bus. <laughs> Spit for the 300 bets. I apologize for what I said earlier. You read my first chat and my second chat first. Sorry. I don't even remember what you said. Black code for the 500 bets. How does one become VIP or mod? Uh, VIP, active in chat. Mods have to like you. Uh, chat has to like you. Bunch of shit. Mod is just usually like long loyalty. I got to trust you to be a mod. My mods have to trust you to be a mod. Shit like that. I probably will mod somebody soon. And then VIP like somebody else. I don't really know when, though. I don't you have, like, sure? a designated time for that. You sure we fit in? Well, it's all we could find. How the hell did they find this party? Bro, they're about to do a line. Excuse me? Have you seen Todd? He said he'll be back. Oh, this is hour. the looking for that Todd guy. Mod 2-inch? Yeah, no, not mod 2-inch. Todd was pissed when his parents wanted to move to Idaho. Did his dad have family here? They have all kinds of money, so... This isn't good. There's too Bro, many people. Bro, somebody said, what in the euphoria is this? This is literally euphoria. Another, yo, another popular show that actually is not that good. Had to say it. Had to say it. Euphoria is not that good of a show. I'm sorry. Not that many high schoolers are, you know, doing meth uh, on their free time. Right? Yeah, like a lot of high schoolers. Yeah, there's a lot of high schoolers that do coke. There's a lot of high schoolers that smoke weed. The intro to the show is just like every motherfucker's overdosing. Euphoria is just, it's exaggerated. It's exaggerated. It's exaggerated the high school experience to the next level. You'd be surprised. Dude, I went to a private Catholic high school where half of those kids had really rich parents and half of them did coke. None of them did meth. None of them were doing crack. None of, yeah, uh, like some of them would do pills. Not every fucking single kid in high school is popping pills and overdosing. It, it's something that happens, but it's not something that every high schooler is doing. It's exaggerated. Clover? What is the it? The poor kids did meth. Dude, even then, no, they're not. Meth? Meth. That's like the that's like one of the hardest drugs you could do. It's for headaches. I think it's ecstasy. Have you done it? Who said it's for no. headaches? Have you? No, but my dad already thinks I'm a drug fiend, so what the fuck? Y'all know, like, like a good majority of MDMA tablets are actually just caffeine and meth. Like, if you've, like, uh, I, it's like, uh, it, specifically in the Northeast, like, I read an article about this. Like, a lot of people that said they've done MDMA have actually done meth. Wait for Todd. Not smoked it, but eaten it. But I just wanted to see what would happen. I feel like that was a bad play. Why are they acting like they're tripping on acid? That's that's not what that's not what would happen. Yo, this looks like the worst party ever. The cops are gonna show up. Yeah, it'll make the game more interesting.
<laughs> Yo, he has no idea what he just took. That is fucking insane. It's not even like, bro, it's like they're acting like he just did DMT or some shit that were salvia. Like he's staring at his hands like they're morphing and shit. He took ecstasy. It's a party drug. It's not like that. It's not like some deep hallucinogen. Isn't this amazing? Who the fuck is Vanessa? I don't know. Dean, I feel so good right now. Like a feather with legs. A feather Here. with legs. See? Do it to me. Lips! What the fuck? Ah! Don't want to. Oh, I didn't even see that answer. Bro, y'all really better. Bro, I only have one override left. I can't waste it. Wait, hold on. I gotta refresh chat. My chat fucking froze. All right, there we go. Yo, he looks like he's tripping balls right now. Even though he's not. Use the bathroom. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> yo, y'all have no idea what I was just thinking about. Anyways, I'll literally explain. I, yo, it's so hilarious when I'm on stream and I just start laughing for no reason, bro. That, for some reason, made me think about when Caitlyn Bennett shit herself at the fucking frat party. Oh, my God. I wish I could show that picture on stream. That is the funniest thing ever, when she shit herself at a frat party. Oh, my God. I'm literally going to look at it myself because I think it's the funniest thing ever. Oh, my God. Literally just passed down on the floor, fucking shit her pants. That is so hilarious. That is so fucking hilarious. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was nasty as fuck. Dude, it's nasty as shit. But it's like, it, whenever she, if you don't know who Caitlyn Bennett is, she's like some like, basically like alt-right, like so far-right uh, political um, conservative. Not, like nothing wrong with being conservative necessarily, but like, it, like I'm a liberal, I have friends that are conservative, nothing wrong with that. But she's so far-right conservative that she'll like literally just interview people and hate on them regardless of who they are. When she, at, whenever she interviews somebody they immediately just bring up the fact that she shit herself at a frat party and she just sits there dead silent. And it's the funniest thing ever because the fucking dude, the picture is so funny. It's literally just like, just poop. Just like, ugh, ugh. it's, uh, oh God. All right. It's like, she got so drunk that she literally passed out and shit her pants. It, but it, it's so fucking hilarious. It's TOS. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm not going to show it. Like, that's disastrous. Shitting your pants at a frat party? Oh, nah. Not even, like, shitting your pants. Like, actually just, like, poop on the floor shitting your pants. How the hell does she see Zoe? All right, now, this is literally not, bro. He's acting like he's tripping. Like, where he's seeing things. Oh, shit. Is he remembering his brother dying? Uh-oh, bad trip encounter. Nightmare, 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 nightmare! Nightmare, nightmare! Your skin feels funny, doesn't it? Together for the 10 gifted! Dub in the chat for that. Thank you, Together Aura, for the 10 gifted subs. Big dub in the chat for that. Appreciate the fucking subs. Not literally, bro's tripping out. Doesn't your skin feel funny? Don't you just want to peel your skin off? Yo, he's literally on the TV. Oh, nah. Yo, is he about to run away from the party? While he's on ecstasy? Oh, he's about to just start running. Oh. Hold up, somebody's self promoing.
Yeah, get shit, man. I'm... BKS for the 300 bits. He thinks he's on acid? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's acting like he's on fucking, like, six grams of shrooms or some shit. Last thing I said was, Joe, smoke meth on Monday. Yeah, meth Mondays. Yeah, for sure. Together for the 10 gifted. Thank you, though. You're the last person I expected to show up asking for a favor. Well, I'm full of surprises. I say we. I say we. I would say we pan this out. I would say we pan this out. You. I didn't even. I didn't even say that. Y'all are already voting for it. I know this is her brother's friend, but it looks like she's trying to like. A full of surprises. What do you mean by that? Look, will you help me or not? What will we give him for it? Oh, oh God. man. You are so freaking tall from down here. What are you looking at? <laughs> oh, man. It's like I'm laying on the ground. It's like, holy shit. Dean, what are you doing? You know this guy? So what if I do? Ooh. I want to say I'm her friend. I'm her boyfriend. Yikes. 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 I I personally would say I'm her friend. I don't know about uh, initiating the I'm her boyfriend. They've known each other for like two days. We go to school together in Arizona. Oh, God. Well, he's not like such a dweeb. Do. Now get out of my room or get out of the party. Yo, I'm throwing Dean, down please. right there. I'm all right. I'm throwing down right there. You ain't some frat leader, dickhead. Stop acting like you're the shit. Buddy, she's asking you to leave. Sorry if that hurt your feelings or something, but it's what she wants. Be a good sport. Can't win them all. That's literally where I shoot them in the balls. That's literally where I pull out a gun and I shoot them in the nuts. That's like actually, that's actually how this scenario pans out. Like, bro, like he's already wanted for that shit. Yo, he got nothing to lose. At this point, that's actually why I just shoot him in the nuts. And then I walk away. It's all right, buddy. You can't win them all. Bang. Right in the balls. Yep. GG's, man. You can't win them all. Walk away. Fuck you. Hit him. Leave them. Yo. Boy, 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 boy. Actually, that might be a terrible idea. I'll let you guys vote. That might really pan out badly for me. He is much larger than, he's much larger than Jay. We might get the shit kicked out of us. I'll let chat choose. All right, we're we're initiating a we're initiating a fight here. Gulp. I just wanted to see what would happen. Come to my party and start this shit here. You started this. Dean, please, let's just go. All right, now, now I'll start the fight. Yeah, now I'll beat the shit out of him. But it's got to be more. It's got to be more. Uh, like you, you, you got to get more on edge. It can't be just so even. Yeah, smash the bottle and stab Dean? him. Yeah, smash the bottle and fucking stab him. Yeah, that's a good idea, Jay. Time Come to on. Go. You're one jealous fuck. Well, guess what? She was mine first. Bottle him. Damn. 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 Badass Jay. Badass Jay coming in clutch. Yeah, I'm about to bottle him. Yup. Yup. Literally break that shit. Ouch. Eat his ass. Yeah, eat his ass. Oh God, you might've killed him. Uh-oh. Bro, he did that hey. on ecstasy too. Hey, someone call 911. Yeah, I don't know if you should call 911. You're all on ecstasy. Might wanna see if it's handleable first. Yo, that is, if that is not the most, that is the most accurate party goer ever.
that dude with that dumbass hat that's just resting on the top of his head. That's literally, that's literally every single person at a college party. Oh my god, that is so fucking accurate. That guy right there on the left. You could have killed him. <laughs> he might have. He's a jerk. I did it for you. It was stupid. Swagging for the sub. Uh, Shady for the three hundred misses. Fentanyl Fridays. Oh god. Ah. Uh, yo, imagine if he said I did it for you. That would have been so cringe. He disrespected you. And I handled it. You said Why you were gonna you do. He literally asked. He did. You didn't handle anything. He literally said, "What are you gonna do for my help?" insinuating that you had to give him sexual advances and you said nothing. He actually did handle it. He was your brother's friend. Because I thought you'd get upset if you knew I'd gone out with him for a while. Apparently, I was right. He could have helped you if you trusted me. We should go find somewhere to sleep before the cops come. But tomorrow, we're done. Uh. <laughs> Yo, just so you know, my date, my name isn't even Dean, dumbass. Just so you know, my name ain't even Dean, dumbass. Like I give a fuck. Where the fuck are they driving? How the hell does their car even have gas? They've driven like six states. Wait, no, they're still in Utah. Oh, yeah, now they're fucked. Swagging for the sub. I'm gonna find somewhere to camp. Don't follow me. Yeah, good shit. What are you gonna sleep on? <sighs> Wait, we shouldn't go too far from the car. <sighs> Yo, she being needy as hell right now. Bye. <laughs> Like, literally trying to, like, actually, actually trying to get attention right now. Bye. Take the car and I'm dipping. Yeah, good shit. Here's a sleeping bag. Fuck you. Somebody said push her off the cliff. Yeah, I don't know about that one. <sighs> Bro, he literally laid out that tarmac. You're going to sleep on the grass. That house you robbed? Was that all it was? A burglary? Nah, I killed a few people. Come clean or don't risk it. Bro, at this point, she already hates us, right? Or she already hates me, Jay. So, like, does it really matter? Does it really matter? Yeah, no, a few people died. You just hop in the car and leave. Look, I need to tell you something. My name's not Dean. My name's not Dean. <laughs> It's Jay. Okay. And it wasn't just any house. It was Sheriff Romero's. I didn't know that till we got there. But Sheriff came home. We ran. Got holed up at this motel on Route 66. You're one of them. The family from the news. Yo, she's dumb as hell. It took her that long to connect the dots. It took her that long to connect the dots. Yo, you are dumb as a bag of fucking rocks. Literally, you've been with him for like three days nonstop, and he already said he robbed somebody in that exact city you were in. He came stumbling out of the fucking woods when you met him. Oh, my God. Flat for the 300 be bits. Be chaos for the 300 It wasn't bets. my idea, but the cops don't care about that. They're blaming me for all of it. People died in that motel. Not because of me. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm sorry. I want you here. It's best if you go. Nah. Bro, both of these are cringe as shit. Oh, this is about to be a dead even vote. Oh, no. It's best if you go. Maybe you're right. Maybe you should go. Maybe because you should go. Crossing the border illegally and all? It could be dangerous. <sighs> there you go again. Acting like I need protection. That's oh not god. it. I oh just... my god. Oh my god. I'm literally saying, I'm telling her to kick rocks. 
I'm telling her, you don't need protection? Kick fucking rocks. I'm jumping in the car and I'm leaving. She's dumb as hell. If he wasn't there, you would have already fucking died. I can't face seeing you get hurt. A little late for that. Tomorrow morning, you can drop me at a gas station. I mean, my dad's gonna kill me, but I'll deal with it. You're more like your family than you realize. I'll always be one of them ready to let go. What the fuck does ready to let go mean? Ready to let go. Like he doesn't want to be a part of his family? I don't like I think that's what it's trying to say. All right, well I guess we'll find out. I'm not like them. Maybe I never was. If you say so. I'm sorry, Vanessa. I really am. Yeah. Me too. Yeah, I'm literally I'm literally leaving. All units be advised. I'm simply Teenager not waiting for her. Is being pursued by the FBI. Consider him armed and dangerous. I think he's the only one that hasn't been caught yet. Oh shit, now we're on the last chapter. Values adventure in the road less traveled, faces danger with courage. I didn't face danger with courage, the fuck. Next chapter. Ducky for the sub. Flatfish for the fringe of bets. All right, now we're on the last chapter, chat. Dub. This is Zoe when she's grown up. Jesus. How deep is the fucking pool? <laughs> 50 seconds that fast. She ain't gonna die. I just want to see what happens. I'm just seeing what happens. Because I think it's causing her flashbacks. Who the fuck is that? Are you okay? Who is Meg? <laughs> Dino for the sub, Ducky for the sub. Play the game I am. March 17th, 2012, St. Louis, Missouri. Ooh. 2012, the year, the year the world ends. Hey, um, you forgot your goggles. <laughs> Thanks. It's Zoe, right? You work at the deli on campus? Sorry, that's not me. No, I recognize you. You make the best meatball subs. That is, that this is such an NPC so conversation. An I don't oh my god. Anymore. Oh, sorry. Look, that thing you were doing in the water. Can I ask what it's about? Holding your breath like that? Some people meditate. I sink to the bottom of the pool. One of these days, I'm going to get to two minutes. Wow. You do this shit every it. day and you're not at two minutes yet? Bro, I feel like if I did that shit for like every day for a, like two weeks, I would be able to do it. Yeah, like, like really? Intense. Why do you do it? The sense of control challenging myself is where I feel okay. None of your business. Oh my God. And I have to fucking relink it. Ah! It's every chapter I keep forgetting I have to fucking relink it. Because it like resets.
Bro, I swear to God, if it puts me back at the beginning. Do y'all want to actually do it now and see what happens? Instead of me not fucking doing it, now I'll actually do it. Now I'll actually press the buttons I need to. I feel like she'll just hold her breath longer. That will be the only thing. It's the same fucking thing. It's literally, don't tell me it's the same fucking thing either way. It's the same fucking thing either way. Are you goddamn kidding me? No, it's not. It can't be. Maybe she'll hold it longer. Why did the lights go out? Don't speak, speak. Don't make a sound. I think it literally just holds her breath longer. I think she'll look down. It'll be at like two minutes. Yeah, it's two minutes. Five seconds left. Oh, maybe she drowns. Oh no, she's fine. Oh, is she gonna drown? Oh, shit! Are you okay? Yeah, she just holds it longer. I, there, that, I, I beat literally, record. I beat my record. Cool. Yeah, nobody gives a fuck. Move on. Yeah, Dino for the sub. Are we finishing the game today? Yeah, this is the last chapter. How do you vote? You just type the number. You type hashtag and then the number. What are those pills she's taking? Hey, um, you forgot your goggles. <laughs> Thanks. You sell so meatballs. Right? You, you make the, the best meatballs. Campus? Sorry, that's not me. You, you make the I best meatballs. You. you make the best meatballs. My subs. friends really like that your meatball guy? subs. So stingy with Fucking the man, yeah. shit. Dude. I don't work there anymore. Oh, sorry. Look, that thing you were doing in the water. Can I ask what it's about? Holding your breath like that? Some people meditate. I sink to the bottom of the pool. One of these days, I'm gonna get to two minutes. You already did. Wow, that sounds intense. Why do you do it? The sense of control, challenging myself. It's where I feel okay, none of your business. 10, 11, 12, or 13. Y'all are literally typing hashtag four when that's not even an option. Oh my God. Motherfuckers putting hashtag four. Yellow for the three. Uh, this chapter already sucks, but I'll see. I'll watch to see what happens to Jay and not this shit. About it. Yeah, no, these Only intros. I've seen I don't know why do they run these. Do it a few these. times now, and it seems kind of. I just don't get it. I know what I'm doing. Don't worry about it. I should be getting home. Look. I know we don't know each Yo, other. Yo, literally punch her in the face. Stop bothering me, May. Need help. Fuck. My mom got sick a few years ago. I was spending every night in the hospital with her, worrying whether she'd make it. And all my friends wanted to talk who about who the it fuck is that? And boy, there was nobody around me who could believe. It. Until I realized there was always someone ready to listen. Bro, is this really her just trying to get... Oh, my God. Uh, thanks. I just saw somebody hand back. Bro, I thought she was going to say, like, oh, I'll be your friend. She handed... She hands me a Jesus card. Damn, y'all are fucking split between that shit. Wow. Right. Maybe. Just ask for me. My name's May. With a Y. Got it. How else would you spell it? With an E? <laughs> Somebody said three. Nobody wants that. No, it's not. Nothing's wrong with her trying to like spread her religion. But I mean, like, bro's like acting like she's gonna say you'll be her friend, and then she hands her a pamphlet. Like what? Okay, I got a bus ticket for two p.m. I also called home and had a chat with Mima. What did she say? Mima? That I didn't give my dad enough of a chance. That he loves me more than I realize, blah, blah, blah. And we both need to try harder. I don't know. Maybe she's right. 
What's in the bag? This? Just some food? For once you start the hike? Yo, is she It'll make the on money me? last a little longer. You didn't have to do that. I didn't have to do any of this. Anyway. Somebody said, yo, stab her. Yo, thanks for all the help. By the way, just shank her in the neck and fucking steal the car. I guess this is it. Thanks for your help. Don't forget about me. Please don't mention Canada. Uh, I don't know. Please don't mention Canada. I mean, like, I don't really think she would anyway. Like, it's kind of obvious that he's going north towards Canada. So even if she did, it's whatever. Yeah, thanks is just a normal answer. You've done so much for me. I don't even know how to say thank you. You don't have to say it. You did a lot for me, too. I did absolutely nothing for her. I, I got going. her I got her an A yeah, on her history I test, and that's it. I should start reading Jane Eyre, because apparently I'll be back for the last week of school after all. <laughs> Goodbye, Jay. Bye, Vanessa. Bro, is he really about to start hitchhiking to fucking Canada? Oh, he gets the car. Oh, shit. Bro, is he near Canada? What fucking state are they in? Oh, she about to cry. She had those clout goggles, too. Ain't nobody fucking wear those anymore. Oh, 260 miles to the Canada border. Do you think they have border More guards the in Canada? The desert dream killers who first I, I feel like they don't. I feel like if you wanted to flee to Canada, you could just jump a fence and go into Canada. I feel like no one would do anything. Rob the two Raw County Sheriff's House. They probably they have them at like at genuine entrances, not like the along the line of like some random mountain. You could probably just walk by. Keep listening. Better not know. I feel like I would want to keep listening just so I know what the fuck they're doing. Just because if it's about me, that might give me info on where the fuck they're looking for me. Describe Jay Holt as an awkward, quiet high school dropout. Holt also has an accomplice, 16-year-old Vanessa Dorland, who is assumed to be armed and dangerous. If you see either of these violent criminals, please call 911 and make... Bro, they said Vanessa was a violent criminal? This is so fucked, I made the news glad Vanessa left. Bro, getting roasted by a radio station? A really awkward looking, a really awkward looking uh, 18 year old high school dropout uh, with basically no family or friends. Sorry, not helping identify him at all. Just absolutely grilling his personality. Like, what does he do once he gets in Canada? Uh-oh. Ucky-wucky. Ucky-wucky. I'm gassing it. Shit. Yo, I'm literally... Got that fucking semi, too? Nah, I'm going right through that bitch. I'm not fucking stopping. Just gas it, bro. He ain't gonna catch you. Morning. Come on. Everything okay, officer? Just running a sobriety checkpoint here, looking for any intoxicated drivers coming it's back to the Lusa Music Festival. Mm -hmm. Were you there? No, sir. I'm just passing through. Can I ask where you're coming from? Arizona, Salt Lake City, San Fran. Don't say, yo, don't say Salt Lake. I would not say Salt, oh, Arizona's also sketch. I'm probably gonna say San Fran. San Fran is like, cause that's nowhere, that's nowhere near where he was. Arizona's where the robbery took place. Salt Lake was where he was last seen. San Francisco, I'm driving cross country. Strange route you're taking. You don't have California plates. Fuck! Uh, no, sir. Huh, uh-huh. Anyway, if I could just see your license and registration, you'll be on your way. 
check glove box. They're in the mail. Sorry, I lost them. Ooh, dude, we're fucked. Any of these answers are shitty. You're not you're not supposed to drive without a license. Saying they're in the mail, maybe, but I'd be like, oh, check the glove box, really, chat? What am I gonna do? Sure. What am I gonna do? The the classic check, like you you know when you have when you know when you didn't do homework in class, and your teacher asks for it, and you do the you do the bag check to make it seem like you had it and you forgot it at your house. You do one of the bag checks. You go, huh? It looks like I misplaced it. <laughs> huh? It looks like I don't have my homework. Uh. Yo, Toasty for the fucking raid. W in the chat for that. Uh, Toasty OG, thank you for the fucking raid, bro. Mr. Bombastic uh, for the 300 bets. Fuck Vanessa, glad she's gone. But she probably would have been able to help me here. Just a sec. Uh, where is it? Uh, I, it seems as if I've misplaced my license. <laughs> well, it's against the law to drive in Montana without a valid driver's license. Uh -oh. I'm really sorry, officer. I'll need to run the plates. Yo, gas it. Yo, literally just fucking dip. Literally Dispatch. just fucking dip. Also, chat, one or two, I need to post on TikTok. Also, chat, one or two, I need to post on TikTok. Six. All right, posting. Well, I'm not posting number six. I'm posting one or two. Two. All right. Posting, posting. Continue. Need you to run some plates for me. Montana, three, papa, two, one, five, seven, tango. Shit. This shit, is the stolen shit, shit. car. Bro, just gas it. What, again? Well, can't you run it manually? Somebody said ship the officer. Bro, yo, he said, can't you run it manually? We could wait. Oh, fuck. Yo, I'll let chat choose. Damn, that was close as hell. That was Look, close as hell. I can explain. <sighs> Goddamn database is down again. There's a sneak peek of Y2K for you. All right. I'm going to let you off with a warning. Next time, bring your license along for the ride. I will, officer. <laughs> Yo! Oh my god, that would have changed everything. If we fucking ran, we would have been fucked. Oh my god, he literally just let me go. Oh my god, I'm gonna make it to Canada. That was a fucking, that was literally game changing. That one decision there. Holy shit. Dude, we could have just fucking dipped and he would have fucking immediately swarmed us. Why don't I just live in the Montana woods? Why the fuck am I even got 14 years later? So I made it to Canada? 2012. Oh, wait, no, this is back to the girl. Shea butter. Pumpkin. Hey, Dad. How's the, um, new plane? Oh, you are gonna love it. So much quieter than the old one. So, um, you okay? It was my birthday on Sunday, and you usually call. Oh, oh buddy's Dad. calling about, she didn't say happy birthday. I'm sorry. It's just, the thing is, I... Gotta make a good impression on the boss, The thing huh? is, I don't really give a fuck about I your birthday, it. Dad. Uh, so I'm the main the character tomorrow, here. Grab a couple of those free sandwiches. That might be tricky. Why? Everything's cool at work, right? My job didn't work out, or sure. Well, didn't it not, it didn't, it's not even that it didn't work out. She's just fucking quit. Didn't she say she quit her job bacon for the sub? I feel like you shouldn't lie to the dad, because Vincent's pretty chill. That was the guy we were playing for so long. To be honest, Dad, things didn't really work out for me with the job. Meaning what? You quit? More like, got let go. Damn, she got fired. Oh, uh, Zoe. What will you do? Oh, I've, I've got a few things lined up. Okay, if you're sure. Why is she fucking panting at that letter? Zoe? Sorry. 
Do you think she would remember that? She's like, what, four or five when that when that occurred? Do you think she would? I mean, probably because it's pretty traumatizing, yeah. I would say she would remember bits and pieces more so than every single moment, though. Yeah, it's definitely because it's PTSD. It would definitely be more memorable than, like, a casual, like, day. Because even though she was, like, four or five, whenever that was, like, it's still definitely more fucking traumatizing. So she would probably remember. Dad, I gotta go. Yeah, kind of like a repressed memory. Hot deck shoes. Don't speak. Don't make a sound. I think she's worried about, like, Jay still being on the run. Shit. I think this is making it seem like he's still out there. Alter anxiety tablet. Yo, she got a nice ass apartment though. Oh my god, am I really gonna look for the other bottle? Like, see, like, why is this a part of the game? Like, this is like filler. Search drawer, search bedside table. I'd shit myself if I heard that. What, the fucking water dripping? That could just be a leaky fucking uh, sink. She had a whole ass Is magazine that? fucking after her. Turn off faucet, search apron, turn on light. Bruh, I have no idea. We all tilted our head. Bro, yeah, no, I wanted to read what the fuck it was. She was acting all surprised by it. Y'all really care about the faucet that much? Oh my god. Huh. Gotta save water. Where was the other option? Yeah, turn on light, stupid as fuck. Don't need the light on. Search storage pack. That ain't gonna have no damn fucking anxiety tablets. Probably the cupboard or the apron. The light we don't need. The fucking storage pack's not gonna have it. Probably your apron. Apron or the fucking cupboard. Here, maybe? Ugh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jay about to pop out. Put, Jay about to pop beside her like Batman. What, what is she looking at? Uh, what? Jesus. What is she in a dream? In a dream? What the fuck? Hmm? Bro, Jay's about to fucking. Jay's about to step up right now. Yo, she's tripping. <sighs> Tell me I'm awake this time. Come on. Think. Oh my god, what am I in a time loop or some shit? I'm gonna fucking freak out. I swear to god. Am I about to really look for him again? Okay, come on. Just go fucking grab him. Yo, she gotta sit here and think about that shit? Yo, Jesus Christ. Just go fucking grab him. Groundhog Day. She's in a fucking time loop like the movie. Yo, what if, why would Jay be stalking her? Who's there? Yo, she's tripping. But he picked out the bear mace. Check the hallway, stay inside. It's probably May. Why would May be sitting on her windowsill? That is fucking weird as shit. Y'all really gonna say stay inside? I would have wanted to check the hallway. Yo, I'm gonna override this shit. I'm gonna check the hallway. I'm curious. I don't care if this is how uh, you die in a fucking horror movie. I wanna see what happens. Maybe somebody's in the hallway. Hello? Bro's out there barefoot with fucking bear mace. If this is a maze. joke, it's not funny. That was your last override? No, it's not. It's a new chapter. I have three overrides a chapter. Now I have two. 
Yo, did she relock the door? Oh, she didn't relock the door. Who is she calling? Hello? Hey, Grandpa. Bro, her grandpa. Zoe. Her grandpa's not dead? It's been like fucking 15 years. It's been like 15 years. That grandpa must be like 95. That motherfucker's still alive? I know it's late, but I, I could use a friendly ear right now. Do you mind if I come over? Oh, uh, thing is... Uh, uh, thing I, is, Zoe, uh, I have some bitches over. Uh, well, I can't have you over. Yeah, I've run into a little, uh, situation. Uh, thing is, Zoe, um, today's Saturday. Saturday's orgy day. Uh, I don't really think it's, uh, good if you come over. What kind of situation? Mr. Walker! I'll be there in ten. It's like I told you, I can't have tenants damaging the building. And I told you, I didn't damage a damn thing. Uh -huh. Mr. Walker. That dog would be fucking dead. Oh my god. Plot flaw. Plot flaw. That dog would be dead as shit. That dog was like three. And what you're telling me that dog's 17 years old? It's been fucking 14 years. It was 1998. Now they're saying it's 2012. Yo, you're bugging, dude. That dog would be dead as shit. Girl, I really don't want to get into another argument. Oh. Hey there, Zeusy, old boy. Zoe, thank God. Old you're boy, here. buddy's decrepit. Please tell this woman I have a right to the quiet enjoyment of my own. My dog's 29? Yeah, submit it to the Guinness World Record book. Your dog's 29 years old. You're fucking kidding me. Your dog, your dog could have a fucking human child if they were a person. What? Oh. Huh. Quiet enjoyment. You vandalized your front door. Okay, slow down. What happened? Somebody broke in and stole my wallet. Uh, no. Mm. You misplaced your wallet and you broke your own front door. Zoe, someone was here. I saw him lurking in the shadows. What did he look like? See, now she's seeing somebody similar. Towels for the sub. Maybe he's not tripping. Yo, sh they might both be tripping. He's very old. It's the Disney sniffer. It's not the Disney fucking sniffer. Tamales for the sub or tamales for the sub. I don't know if I'm saying your name right. Did you get a good look at him? Was he wearing a black hoodie? Oh, uh, uh, maybe, I, I, I don't quite Yo, he's remember. old as fuck. You Stop, yo, remember. yo, literally ignore him. He is old as shit, but he's 90 years old. You cannot take any credibility of what the fuck he's saying. Because it didn't happen. Hmm. I'll tell you what did. Your grandfather wandered outside in his robe for the third time this month. When he realized he didn't have his keys, he broke the door to get back in. That is not true. I wanted some air, so I, I took a walk, and, uh, and I, I saw someone, and, uh, yeah, I, and then the next thing I know, I'm arguing with, with Shelby here. That's not even my name. Yeah. Zoe, I know this is painful to hear, but your grandfather is declining. He needs a nurse or an assisted living oh, home God or... Oh, goddammit, I don't need assisted anything we obviously have very different interpretations of what happened still how do you lock yourself out without a key alzheimer's dude when people when old people get alzheimer's they'll be pulled over by cops on the road not knowing where they are or even how to drive a car like that it can get to that point like, they don't know where they are. They get lost in public. They'll be walking, right? Like, say they're like, like, if it gets to the point where your Alzheimer's gets pretty bad, like, you could be on a drive, like, going to the grocery store and then forget where you are, like, halfway there. Somebody will have to pay for that door. Even if you've lived there your entire life, you could literally be like, where am I? Who am I? Like, just genuinely lost. We'll pay. Insurance can pay. Just let him be. Well, you can't really say just let him be, because he did break the fucking door. So you kind of have to pay for the door. Chad, if y'all really about to say it, just let him be, that's really not going to help. 
Insurance. Insurance ain't gonna pay for a broken door. Don't you have some kind of insurance? It's his front door. He broke it. Huh? He pays for it. Can you believe that woman? Assisted living. Imagine he has poop smeared all over the walls. She sounds just like you. Can you believe that woman? Assisted living. But he's got eggs in the freezer and shit. His bed's on the ceiling. His bed's taped to the ceiling. He's got shit all over the walls. Well, they're telling me I'm crazy. Your dad with that garbage. <laughs> Don't tell Shelby. <laughs> but I know I didn't break my door because I keep a spare key under the mat. You do? Isn't that kind of unsafe? You want to hide something where no one will find it? Stick it right under their noses. Yeah, you're dumb as shit, old man. Under the mat's the common place where everybody keeps a key. That ain't funny. That's the dumbest place you could keep a key. Right under their noses. Not if somebody's trying to rob your house. They just fucking, uh, they just check under the mat and take your key. <laughs> How are you doing, kiddo? Anything new? Me? I'm fine. Oh, you don't look fine. Bcas for three hundred bucks. Grants for sure. Skits in. Yeah, literally. How you been sleeping? Having nightmares. Good if I take meds like a baby. Like a baby is just straight cap. She's having. She's had a dream in a dream in a dream, and she's fucking thinking people are following her, which they might be. Having nightmares. Didn't have a bad night for months. Until the nightmares started creeping back. Now, I'm scared to fall asleep. Oh, Zoe. Okay, what are these long-ass chats? Joe?
up! Where's my tablet computer thing? Oh, no. Those bastards. I got the communists stole them again. I've heard them in the walls recently. I've been hunting them down. I can't seem to find them. My, the Russian spies are after me. Zen for the sub. That for my 74th. Mind if I look around a little? Maybe I can figure out who stole your stuff. Be my guest. Bro. Oh. Sofa, shelf, TV stand, dresser, broken door. I mean, looking at the broken door, like, like this makes no sense. Like, the fuck am I going to look at the sofa for? Yeah, the broken door is where they got in. But, like, what am I going to see there? Fucking fingerprints? Remind me. Where were you when this guy broke in? Just down the hall, I think. Sometimes I water those petunias on the shared windowsill. I thought you said you were taking a walk? Oh, uh, I was. <sighs> or I was going to. Oh my I... god, you can't understand a thing this man is saying. But he's changing fucking shit 45 fucking thousand times, dude. You were going on a walk, you weren't going on a walk, you were watering petunias, you were taking a shit on the wall. What the fuck were you doing? My god. You know you've had the exact same couch my entire life? Bought that thing back in 98, the week after, you know, when we came to St. Louis. And it just keeps getting comfier. Grandpa. Oh, uh, there it is. Huh. Glad they didn't take that too. He's now probably on level 10,000 on Candy Crush. It matters. All I know how to do with it is play solitaire. Ah, oh, he only knows how to play solitaire. Even more boring. Even more boring than fucking Candy Crush. How could it possibly be worse? Solitaire. Probably the worst game ever. I get headaches trying to play that fucking game. Level 10,000 on Candy Crush is insane. Dude, there's people that are maxed out. There's people that have to wait every week for the next level. All books, medical books. Is this all from when you were a traveling salesman? Salesman? Yeah, you told me you used to... Wasn't that your job? No, you yeah, talked back then you could say I was a jack of all trades. I think the only real job I ever had was convincing people I was someone else. Oh, his wallet's right there. Grandpa? Are you sure you didn't break the door yourself? Yo, I'm putting him in a nursing home. I'm so sorry. Like, that's... Bro, he can't live alone anymore. He can't... He, yo, he can't live alone anymore. At that point, bro, he breaks down his own door, starts saying somebody's fucking robbing him and shit. Oh, my... How did he even break the door? What, did he kick that shit the fuck down? What, does he got Hulk strength? How can I be sure of something I can't remember? Have you never gone into a room, forgotten why you came in? Yeah, I've Have done that. Ever misplaced or lost something? You know I've lost plenty. I don't want to lose you too. Somebody said he's wasting oxygen. Put him down. See, now nah, that's fucked, right? Because he's your grandpa. But like, he can't live alone. Tell so put wife. him down. You don't put it's him down. Worse. Places, dates, the school I went to. It's like someone's slowly packing my memories into boxes and none of them have labels on. Can you imagine how that feels? Damn. Sounds terrible. For me, it's a relief. I don't think she should say, for me, it's a relief. Like, yeah, she would... She. She doesn't want to remember the past, but then you're just like, then you're downplaying your fucking grandpa's Alzheimer's. Like, it's not a big deal. Yeah, sorry, Gramps. Sorry, Gramps, you can't remember what fucking Sounds school awful. you went to. I can't even begin to. 
You must think I made this whole damn mess up. Actually, someone's been following me too, I think. What? Earlier at the pool. And then tonight at my apartment, I, I thought I saw someone. But I don't know if it's even real. I feel like we're both losing our minds. Good God. Somebody banned the kid in my chat that just said they were 10. Like, dude, even if you're like, and I already know, this motherfucker's going to submit an unbanned request. Oh, I was joking about that. You're banned in my chat either way. Adios. Either you're too young to use Twitch or you're just trying to get banned for the fucking memes. Either way, goodbye. Zoe, look. I know you went through hell as a kid. Losing your mom like My that. brother typed that. Boss for the 300 bits. What do you think about that Jeep truck? Eh. I don't think it's as good as a regular Jeep, but it doesn't look and bad I to me. I know you sometimes think it drove you half crazy. It has. Don't go there. Bro, this is not an invitation for my chat to all announce how old they are. Like, oh my god, yeah, let's start let's start announcing our zodiac signs next. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god. Yeah, like I I, I mentioned it one time because this kid's too young to be in my chat. Motherfucker starts Oh well actually, uh I'm uh I'm an Aquarius. I Fuck! I don't. But that's what I'm trying to say. I don't think you are crazy at all. Because if you were, how could we both be seeing the same thing? Because you're both crazy. Either we're both losing our marbles. Yeah. Or, or what? No. It's impossible. <coughs> that motherfucker can still bark? Who is that? Probably just some dude on the street. Huh? It's probably just some regular guy. Stop! Yo, who is she running at? Probably some random dude. Why are you following me? What do you want? Leave. Yo, he's actually probably not there. Yo, they're seeing things. They have to be. Yeah, she's gonna get hit by a car too. Stop! Like, why Stop would I why said. would he ever follow her? Get the fuck off me! I'm sorry. I thought you were. Why would he ever follow you? Like, there's no reason for her for for Jay to ever come back and see her, like at all. Like, he doesn't have anything she wants. There's no information she has. She has nothing. Why the fuck would he ever come back? Yo, they're literally both going insane. Oh, sweetheart. Somebody said it's, it's okay. Jonah Hill. I'm here. I was fine. Where is Jay was in Canada? Fine. And then one little trigger and bam. It all came roaring back again. The two of us, me trying to remember you, trying to forget. I don't want to forget. I just want to not care. How do I do that? How do I make the past leave me alone when I keep seeing it everywhere I go? I guess you just need to stand up and face it. <sighs> Look it in the eye and see this thing. Oh, for what is it? Some shit in the shoebox. If the past talks to you, you listen. Oh, it's a letter. And when it's done, then maybe you'll be free. Oh my God! Yo, he's writing her letters. Why? Why? What the fuck? Hey Zoe, this is no, it's not her mom or mom. Yo, for okay, okay. For the person that said it's her mom, her mom is fucking dead. Okay, her mom's not writing him letters or her letters. Okay, what? 
Nah, I don't think he's trying to be a weirdo. I think he might be trying to apologize. You know what I mean? Like, motherfuckers say, like, I think it's odd that he's writing her letters because there's no point. I don't think he's trying to be a weirdo, like you guys are saying. I think he's just trying to apologize for the shit he did, right? Because he traumatized this kid. Like, by basically putting her in a hostage situation when she was five. He, he feels bad, but... Third letter. I haven't heard back from you, so... I hope you're getting them. I was thinking today about the last time I saw you. You were a little kid, clinging to your family. How the hell? Okay, no, I'm changing back on what I said. How the hell does he know where she lives? Like, I'm sitting here like, oh yeah, he's apologizing. He still had to find out where she lived. Like, you don't just know that. Like, why, like... <laughs> I was an 18 year old, clinging to the idea of freedom. Bro, where is he? Oh, he's literally gonna go, he's gonna go flee to Canada. I remember your face when we took your dad away. It felt right to me, knowing you'd get clear of us. What if I didn't do that? Would he just die right here and not cross the border? Would the game just end? Ways, nothing that day felt right. I know my family scarred you for life. Carve initials or leave no mark. I've always wanted to do that on like a new tree. Cause it's pretty cool if you carve if you carve your initials on a tree, that tree will last way past when you die. Red for the sub. So you could write your name on a living thing and it would still surpass you. That looks like a T. They left their mark on me too. I wonder every day who I could have been. <laughs> Unless if somebody chops it down, house. that's true. There's a lot I want to say to you, Zoe. Things to ask. Things to explain. About how we can- Yo, I'm about to start doing that. Every time I take a trip, I'm about to carve my name into one tree. Every single time. Yo, that's a W idea. I'm gonna do that. To be at the motel that night. And what happened in the mountains a few days afterward. I'm sure you learned some of it as you got older. But there's other things. I'm Keep sure hiking? That's the only fucking option. Why is this even a fucking thing? The only option is keep hiking. What? <laughs> Why are they even giving me the option? Wow, one option. Which do we choose? Please write back, Zoe. I need to hear from you. Yours, Jay. Hey there. <gasps> How's the hike? Mm. Uh. Goal. Okay. I just push uh, the park ranger down the mountain. I was trying to work out where I am. Oh well, let's see. This here's Jacob's Ridge. And that down there is Lake Blackfoot in the de facto Canadian border. Oh. And if you continue up that trail over there, you'll get to the top of Blackfoot Falls. But he just told him how to get to Canada. Where's the border station? Yeah, see, there ain't no damn border station. I was saying that. There's no damn way all of Canada's got some fucking fence or some shit. You can just run. Further east, it's out of range for a day hike. You uh, got a campsite set up somewhere? Of course not yet. There's no way we don't make it over. Because they already did the future of him sending letters. So no matter what I do, I have to make it over the border. Or it's somehow at least not get caught, even if I don't get over to the Canadian border. Red for the sub. No, not yet. Well, where's your stuff? 
backpack, or... Uh... I don't... I was gonna build a shelter. Build one, huh? <laughs> well, I admire that, but uh, that's not exactly... Uh... You got a backcountry permit? Permit? Sorry. Buddy said permit. But you're gonna have to head back down. Can I just stay a little longer? Enjoy the view? Hmm. Why don't I stay too? I was about to have some All right, tea. stab the old man. Want some? All right, pull out the shank. Uh, no, All thanks. right, kill him. So, what's your name? Ah, uh, shit. Ah, uh, fuck. Michael? Michael. I'm Leland. Well, You're, Leland, uh, this is your last day on uh, Earth, shank. Yep. Did stints in Zion, Bryce Canyon, <laughs> Pinnacles. Hold this for me. <laughs> My whole chat's saying shiv him. All right, looks like he's got to die. He's sitting next to us. Joel for the five gifteds. Or Joel. I don't know how to say your name. Thank you, Joel underscore EXE for the fucking five gifted subs. Stop in the chat for that. Thank you, Joel, if you got a sub. But thank you for the five gifteds. Yeah, I spent nearly a decade there. There can be nothing in the world more beautiful than the Canyon of the Yellowstone. That was said by... Theodore Roosevelt. That's right. So, you're a nature lover too, huh? You've got my dream job, more of a history buff. Saw that on a postcard. But I'm about to say you got my dream job. Maybe you'll hook me up. I still got two overrides. Oh, y'all are voting for that anyway. Saw that on a postcard. What fucking postcard would have Teddy Roosevelt on it? I used to spend a lot of time in the forest near my house. You've sort of got my dream job. Well, fill out an application down at the visitor center. Really? It's that easy? Sure. You can clear the background check. Gulp. <laughs> Gulp. Well, you see, uh, um, uh, I killed a few people. Um. I don't think I'm going to pass the background check. Mm. That's nice. Somebody said, why are you watching you a know, movie? This isn't a movie. I've seen a lot of crazy things up here. Forest fires, avalanches. But I always wondered, is it really necessary that we carry these? But we are Border Patrol. In the rare event some criminal makes a run for it, we need to be prepared. All right, pull out the shiv. <laughs> All Look, right. You seem like a nice kid, but we got a stolen car down at the trailhead, which State PD says belongs to an 18-year-old who shot up a motel in Arizona and was last seen headed north. Now, you got no water bottle, no headlamp, and you sure aren't dressed for camping without a tent. So, what's the deal here, Michael? I could overpower you. Please let me go. I could overpower you. You've got me wrong. I'm not saying I could overpower you. I'm simply not saying that. I'm... Bro. Bro. All right, good shit. You've made a mistake, sir. Have I? Then show me a driver's license. Show me a credit card. How about hiking shoes? Hell, a sweater. Look, it's no kind of life running from the law. You'll be living with that shadow over you forever. Oh my God! Does he take you to? <gasps> does he go to jail? And he's sending he's sending letters from prison. On the hill, I've never once fired this thing, and I sure don't want to start now. I'll let chat choose. I don't want to override a. This is like a definitive thing. I would have. I would have hit surrender. Hey. I would have hit surrender. 
I don't know why you guys said run. I think that's stupid. Because now they know I'm in Canada, too. Yeah, this is a bad play for sure. Yo, he's going to get domed, buddy. You know I mean? For the love of God, stop running. How the hell is he catching up to me? He's like 60. What am I about to jump the border? I'm about to die here. Yeah, I don't know about jumping over that. Yeah, I'm stuck. Well. All right. It's over, all right. There's nowhere else to run. He's such an old he's such a nice old guy, too. What are you doing? Am I about to jump? Going to Canada. Yo, he's really oh yo, Whatever he actually just thinking, fucking thrashed you me. You don't need to no, 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 no. I'm not, I, no, I want to see what he's going to say. I want to see what he's going to say. Enough. I shouldn't fight him. Leland Park Base. I've got an emergency at the top of Blackfoot Falls. Please send the rescue helicopter. Hate me if you like, but I'm not watching you die. Whatever you- Yo, y'all said Common Joe L. I would have to jump off a fucking mountain. Chat, you think I'm surviving that fall? Y'all just said comment you would survive. No, I would not. Bro, you would not live that. Yo, imagine jumping down Niagara Falls. You're dead. Plot armor? Yo, no, it's not plot armor. You did. You're just gonna have to face it. You would- I would have died. Damn, so what's gonna happen now? Ooh, is she coming to the prison? That's probably where the letters are coming from. Pumpkin, I don't feel good about our talk. Sure, you're okay. Where the fuck is she bussing to? This I would have rather watched him die than get arrested. Everyone out. Yo, she, I feel like she eats too many of those. She's taking like fucking 10 a day. Oh, it is prison. Wow. Yo, I'm going to say this right now. I think even if I didn't do that, but even if I did that button mash chat, it, it, they still would have caught me. Y'all really think, y'all really think the game would have let me jump off a mountain, not die in the waterfall, swim to Canada, somehow find a job, never get caught in 14 years, never get caught, somehow live a life illegally as an illegal immigrant in Canada, somehow p send postal cards and not get caught. Really, really, really. Okay. 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 Yeah, my whole chat's saying yes. Have a seat. Bro, we'll look up the alternative ending. Because she was going to meet him anyway. Bro, I don't think that it would have ended like that. I don't think that it would have ended like that. She was going to meet him anyway. What, would she have flown to Canada and met up with him? F Jan for the sub. No one would ever do that. Yo, she mean mugging that shit. Don't speak. Don't make a sound. Yo, what is he about to look like? He's going to be looking, like, way older. Oh, my God. He looks so fucking weird. 
Oh my god, dude. He looks like such a dweeb. He looks like he smells even more like cheese curds. Holy shit. Somebody said Discord mod. You came. I wasn't sure you got the letters. I got them. One a month ever since March. You've grown up. I remember you as this six-year-old kid who was scared of the dark. You were younger too. You haven't changed. Not scared anymore. Well, he definitely has changed. He he grew a little. He grew a little like scruff beard and got glasses, and changed the haircut. You were younger too. And you were a freckly teenager who barely even talked. Fourteen years inside will change anybody. Though I still don't talk much if I don't have to. Now you think Jay's somebody's bitch in prison? <sighs> you know they're executing me tomorrow. Oh! Bro! I forgot that he would be on death row. Yo, he ain't even kill any of them, no. Nah, bro. He's on death row. Yo, you're fucking kidding me. I thought he was getting the fucking death penalty. Yeah, apparently he is now. Shady for the 300 bets. I know. I have to say, I didn't think you'd come. I didn't either. Yo, do y'all think he deserves the death penalty, though? Like, I'm literally writing a paper on capital punishment for my sociology class right now. Like, it, like it, in, in the majority of scenarios, but, like, even especially this one. Like, I know, I know they got some strict laws for death penalties and shit down south, but, like, fuck, dude. Death penalty? He, 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 he was accomplice to murder, and he held a robbery. Like, yeah, an accomplice to murder, like, that should be a large prison sentence. They don't, shouldn't murder you for that. The bread for the sub. He deserves it. See, I don't, I don't understand that. I don't think, like, there's a lot of reasons. Like, a big point, like, there's, like, three main reasons on why I don't think capital punishment makes sense. Number one, there's a big issue of, in, like, uh, morality with it. Uh, number two, it actually costs more money to murder somebody in the United States by capital punishment than it does to keep them in prison for the entirety of their lives. The tax money that you pay goes largely, like, it, it's more money for a taxpayer to kill somebody than it is for um, life imprisonment. Uh, and then thirdly, it's just already kind of on its way out. Julie for the fucking 5,000 bits! Or Jewel Axie for the fucking 5,000 bitties. Dumb in the chat for that. W bets. Thank you for the 5,000 fucking bets. Holy shit. Oh my God. Thank you for the 5,000 bitties. All right. We got to vote on this. Cut to the chase. Heard from Vanessa. What's prison been like? How will tomorrow go? Talk to your mom. What about Tyler? Bro, are these all about to be dead? So, tomorrow, what happens exactly? Do, do they? It's all scripted, down to the minute. They move me to a different cell, change my clothes. Then I get the meal, spaghetti and meatballs, smothered in cheese. After that, bro. Like, just imagine, like, that's, like, being on, people that are on death row are some of the only people that know the day they're going to die, right? Like, you're literally sitting there, it's, it's literally, it's not just a countdown, it's a countdown with a definitive ending. Like, we all know we're going to die, but we don't know when we're going to die. They know the exact minute they're going to die. Like, that's insane. And bro, Joel, uh, Joel or Joel, thank you for the 5,000 biddies again, bro. 
Bit of a shitty I'm meal sorry. to pick for the last meal, though. I shouldn't have asked. Heard from Vanessa. What's prison been like? Talk to your mom. What about Tyler? Enough questions. Yeah, what about Tyler? That was the brother. He, I didn't even know he was still alive. They might have already killed him. That and the mom. The mom and the fucking brother. They, most, they, they both might be dead. Your brother, Tyler. He's here too, right? <sighs> He's here. But we're not allowed to see each other. We got the same sentence. How long until they carry it out? There's no date yet. All I know is I'm going first. Wait, wait, that, that ain't fair at all. That ain't fair at all. He did it. Yo, the brother shot like three people. The, the Yo, Tyler literally murdered two cops and shot the wife. Why is he dying first? Talk to your mom. What's prison been like heard from Vanessa? But I want to know what the fuck's going on with the mom. Because the mom got arrested like way back before any of them. Bro, do you think she would be able to somehow stop the, the death execution? Your mom's in a prison not far from here, right? She writes me every week. She's made friends with the right people. I think she's doing good. Have you been able to see her? No. No, she's got 20 more years. Oh, she'll die in prison. You know she got a lesser sentence just for pleading guilty. I read about it. Don't know why they didn't offer me that. <laughs> but I'm glad she'll be all right. Did you ever see the youngest kid that ever got a death sentence in the United States was 15? And he was proven innocent like 20 years after he died. He killed, they, they, they said he killed one person. Um, it was like during World War II, like 1942. And he was like, I didn't fucking kill them. And then they ended up finding out that, yeah, he was 14. No, I think it was, oh yeah, no, he might've been. Wait, hold up. Youngest person executed. That's great. George, George Steiny Jr., was electrocuted by the electric chair in June of 1944 in South Carolina. The youngest person ever to be executed in the 20th century. This was him. Bro, 14. 14. Bro, half of y'all are probably 14. Imagine getting executed now. Imagine being on death row. At 14, and not even death row today, where they shoot you with a fucking, um, like, needle. Like, you're getting the electric hair. They, they shock you to death. Fuck. That's one, of the re that's one of the things that I'm using for, like, an argument against capital punishment. Because I think capital punishment, I don't, I don't think it's needed. I understand the purpose of, like, oh, uh, you're trying to get rid of people that are kind of a threat forever. But at that point, just give them an indefinite life imprisonment. And I think that's worse, right? Am I wrong? When you're on death row, you get better cells and you're still alive for like 15 years. Life imprisonment, I think, is worse than death row. Death is the easy way out. Like imagine imagine you're a serial killer. Now, now you don't have to serve the rest of your life. Life imprisonment's awful. You don't get, you're, you're, in, you're literally in a cell forever and then you die. You get to live zero life rather than just getting an easy way out. Now you're forced to live. YSA for the sub. Most people on death row usually want to die. Like, like in terms of like serial killers, like the real, like the people that really deserve it are, are usually people that actually don't care. What's prison been like? Heard from Vanessa enough questions. Yeah. Like Ted Bundy. Ted Bundy was like, let's get it over with. Half of the half of people like their last quotes like all right good shit, like they they would have rather died than been in prison. That V on your arm. Is it for Vanessa? Yeah. She was pretty special, kind, fierce. 
cringe. You knew her for five days. I looked her up once. Jeffrey Dahmer got killed in a cell by his bun bunk mate. I'm saying Ted Bundy. Oh, did I say Jeffrey Dahmer? I meant Ted Bundy. She's doing well. Works behind the scenes. Bro, you know one of the you know one of the wackest quotes that's like really profound. Wait. One of one of the most profound quotes I've ever heard literally came from a death row inmate as his last words. Robert Alton Harris was a murderer, bank robber, or not bank robber, burglar, murderer, and um just like escaped convict. You can be a king or a street sweeper, but at the end of the day, everybody dances with a grim reaper. Damn. Like that's literally facts. That's literally facts. Doesn't matter who you are. That's like, a lot of people always say, yo, we're all equals because we're humans. Yes, that's true. But it's also like, you're never better than anybody unless you're immortal. Like, like at the end of the day, the idea of like racism, homophobia, sexism, like at any of that shit is not only dumb because we're all humans and you didn't choose what body you were born in, but we're all going to fucking die. No matter how much money you make, no matter how popular you are, no matter at what fucking situation you're in. You're going to die just like everybody else until there's a day where somebody can confidently claim that they are immortal and incapable of dying. Every single person on earth is equal forever. It's on some TV show. Cause you can't escape that. Got this. So I wouldn't forget. I almost ruined her life. Some people live longer. That don't matter at all. A hundred years from now, Basically, every person on this earth will be dead. We will, uh, every single, there's 2,229 people in this chat. We will all be dead in 100 years. Every single one of us. Get Maybe one person will live to 115 and then they'll fucking die, right? But at the end of the day, within 150 years, okay, let's extend it. All of us will be dead. So, like, it doesn't matter when. Yeah, some of us are probably... A lot of us are going to die before others. A lot of us are going to die later than others. Out of the 2,229 people here, some of us will live to 60. Some of us will die in two years. Some of us will die in 10 years. Some of us will die in, in fucking 70 years. But at the end of the fucking day, we will all die. No one will live forever. Look, Jay. What's wrong? I keep seeing your face. In my dreams, out on the streets, I... I know it can't really be you, but it feels like you. That's why I finally came. I had to see you. Otherwise, I just couldn't keep going. Zoe, are you all right? I know I've been in here a long time, but I can still tell when someone's not okay. I'm not doing well, none of your business. I'm doing I'm doing great. Bro, I'm only letting chat choose I'm not doing well. Cause these two are dickhead responses. Like, I understand like she went through a lot of trauma, but like Buddy's literally gonna die tomorrow. And he's trying to comfort her. That night, when you took me upstairs and the power went out. Do you remember? Of course. I was terrified. You said don't make a sound. And it's like I've been holding my breath ever since. When all I really want to do is scream and scream and never stop. I was just trying to get you quiet. The cops were breaking in. I didn't want you to get hurt. I know. I didn't say it made sense. I needed to be over. Jay. Our lives have been so different. But in some ways, we're the same. We both landed in the wrong place at the wrong time and tried to make the best of things. Maybe we are, we're nothing alike. Like, dude, if this were like Tyler or one of the other brothers, I'd be like, okay, fuck you, we're nothing alike. But, like, Jay it was, like, in part, bad time, bad situation. Like, literally just unlucky. Like, he didn't even want to commit the crime initially. He was like, this is a bad idea. Maybe we are alike in a way. I 
I can't stay much longer. You said in your letters you had something you wanted to ask me. Oh, is he going to ask for him? I'm all out of appeals, Zoe. Clemency is a long shot. There's a call into the governor on account of that I never actually killed anybody. But chances are I'm dying tomorrow. And when I think back on all the mistakes I made, all the people I hurt, you must hate me. After everything my family did to you. Oh, dude, the ending of this game is just rough. This is just rough. Dude, I don't know. You looked out for me. Your family ruined me. Bro, I really don't want Jay to die. I really don't want Jay to die. Fuck. Jay, I won't lie. Seeing you isn't easy. But he was the nice brother. You were brother. part of my mom's death. I've been afraid of this moment for a very long time. But you also looked out for me that night. I can't pretend I don't remember that too. So no. I don't hate you. <sighs> Everything that happened? How can you be so forgiving? Because you've suffered. Anger would ruin me. You're a kind person. <sighs> Bro, literally every, like, this whole fucking time, he never really did anything that was, like, I mean, like, he was in bad situations, but he never wanted to do anything bad. Like, ever. I just can't bring myself to hate the person I see behind this glass. <sighs> I wish the state saw it that way. But if that's how you feel, then I want to ask you a favor. This thing's probably going to happen tomorrow. They'll strap me to that gurney, and then I don't want the last face I see to be a stranger's. He's not even asking. Oh, my God, bro. This, this is going to make me cry. This is going to make me cry. He's not even asking. I thought he was going to ask for her to go to the governor and plea for a pardon. He's asking for her to attend his death. That is so sad. That is so fucking sad. Oh my god, you got the shit ending? Dude, this might be one of the better endings. In terms of, like, how entertaining this is? Bro, this is insane. I want it to be yours. What? Be there tomorrow. Please. Let me die looking at someone who knows me. Oh, he knows no one else. No. I'm... I'm going home in an hour. Stay. Please. No. No, don't you understand? Bro, I really... Didn't y'all think that he was gonna say, could you pardon? Like, I really thought he was gonna... I, I really thought he was gonna say, yeah, you could go to the governor. Because, like, if she's a part of the situation, she could easily sway his favor. You know what I mean? Like, if you're, if, if somebody that was, like, literally the reason that he's in jail goes and says, could you please pardon, that could easily work. I can't! Neither can I. I don't want to do this alone. See, that's so sad. That's so sad. <sighs> Witness it. Why me? No more trauma. Wow. We're really going to witness his death? Dude, I wish there was an option to save him. You ever just want to sink to the bottom of an ocean and stay there forever? Every single day. What time does it happen? Midnight. Wow. Okay. I'll come. I'll sit where you can see me and whatever you feel. Dude, is that like a better way? Like my thing is like, ugh, I always think about this, right? Like, have you all ever thought about how you're going to die? Like, I don't want to die till I'm old, obviously, but like, when you're when you die 
a lot of the time you're not conscious before you die. Like most people usually die on their, like you have a deathbed. Like most people die in the hospital, right? Like you don't know your last moments. Whether you die in your sleep, you don't know it was your last day. Or you're you're in bad condition, but then you kind of go into like a, like a coma or some sort of state, and then they pull the plug and you die, right? And you never know. Very few people, very few people, even if you know that you're gonna die soon, which a lot of people end up knowing, a lot of people like you, you almost no one knows the exact moment they're gonna die. Would you rather know? Like, you're going to die and then witness your last moments? Or would you rather it be random? Like, this is genuinely a question. I want to see what you guys would say. I wouldn't. I, I don't know. I would want to know. I feel like I would want to witness my last moments. Just where it's like, because, like, I would never want, like, but, like, death row inmates do witness that. Like, they, they get injected, and they sit there, and then they slowly fade into unconsciousness, and then they die, and their heart stops. Uh, randomness is just... Just because then I feel like... I, I don't know. I feel like I, I would want to... I, I want to change my life to, this, to the sense where, like, I would be okay with it being random. Because then you don't have regrets, right? But I would still want to witness what it would be like. I don't know, though. I, I, the, the, my biggest fear is I really, I really, I, I think Alzheimer's is one of the scariest things. Like the, what their dad had, uh, or, or what Jim had, not having any sort of sense of when, of like where you are, you lose sense of yourself. Before you die, you basically die, right? Like even though you're alive, who you are disappears. Gabriel for the 10 says Joe Flex. That's a channel point redemption. You gotta redeem the channel point for that. That's why I have it set for that. Uh, but get, I'll do it. I'll do a flex, but just for future reference, don't donate for, for channel point redemptions. Thank you for the 10. Nah, I don't know. I just feel like dying a random death. It kind of is kind of shitty. That's all right. I'll if you know, you live your life in fear. You're still going to let you're still, you're, you're not going to live your life in fear, but you're going to start questioning that when you're 65, 70, 80, you're going to know there's, there's only a certain amount of time left. Like, when you're 80, it's almost sure that you're not going to live another 30 years, right? Like, right now, we're all young. We can have the hopes of, of living another 40, 50, 60, 70 years, right? But when you're sitting there, like your grandparents, if they're still alive. Like, your grandparents, or even your parents, like, they know that there's not going to be another 50 years for them, right? Another 60 years for them. Like, theoretically, I'm 20. I turn 21 in less than a week. I could, I could theoretically live another 50, 60 years. Your parents and grandparents know they can't. My mom's 62. Exactly. Like, your mom knows she's not going to live another 60 years. She'd be 122. Hammy for the 300 bets. This might sound sane, but I feel like there's a chance I've seen my death. I had a dream... But it didn't feel like a dream or like deja vu. It makes me worry I could have seen my death. Was it n near future or was it something far away? Thank you. Thank you so much. Like, that really is terrifying. Like, we're literally all going to die one day. Like, that's what that shit makes me think about all the time. The I mean, it's, shadows it's common knowledge, but I feel like people don't think about it. And I know it's depressing to think about, but, like, bro, most people live their entire lives not recognizing that, like, this isn't forever. Like, we will die. You can't escape them. And cease to, and not die. Bro, like, yes, like, it, like a lot of people have their own religious or philosophical beliefs. But, like, in my own belief, like, sometimes I sit there and I'm like, wow, like, this could literally be the only existence I ever have for eternity. Like, this could literally be it. Yo, we'll talk about this more on Monday on my birthday when I'm high and I feel I'll, I'll be more philosophical. But, like, damn. Like, holy shit. I just want to be, I want to be okay with dying before I die. I don't want to be afraid of it. But right now, I would, right now I'm afraid of it. Right now I would not want to die. You just we need more philosophy streams. Uh, yeah, I know. 
on Monday, it'll be a slew of things, right? On Monday, y'all might see me talk philosophically. Y'all might see me cry. Y'all might see me fucking do whatever, right? Like, that might be, that might be fucking insane. Like, yo, Monday is going to be a jumble of shit. We're going to be playing video games. I'm going to be drinking. I'm going to be smoking. Oh, fuck. It's going to be, yo, I'm excited. Yo, it'll be too many things going on on Monday. Fuck. Uh, Sim for the 300 bits. Oh, near future. I remember it all perfectly. I have a few seconds of consciousness before it fades black. Doesn't help that I've always felt like I'll die young. Well, I don't know. Sin for the 300 bits. Joe, knowing when you're going to die is a complicated topic. I hope this makes sense, but I feel like you'd be more reckless before your death. And the hypothetical window would keep shrinking and shrinking. Honor for the sub. Yeah, no, I wouldn't want to be told, like, I, I, there's always the question, how, like, would you guys want to know how would you, how would you die or when you would die? I would never want to know how I would die. Because then you would always live your life avoiding it just for it to end up happening anyway. Knowing when you die, yeah, you could start living more recklessly, but like, bro, like, if you could tell me when I'm going to die, and you said like 80, I'm going to live my life how I'm going to live right now, right? But if you told me you're going to die in 30, in 10 years, I'd be like, shit, I got a fucking kick up, right? Like, I would honor for the sub. Like, if you told me, Joe, you're going to die in 10 years, how well I would live my life would change drastically. I would, I would fucking, I would probably work way harder for the next three years and then quit and just, and just travel the world. Like, no doubt. And look toward the light. See, like, Hello. oh my God, and she's the only person there. Are they going to pardon him? It's your lucky day. The governor's commuting your sentence. Why nah. are some of us able to grow and change? Nah, yo, that's a fucking dub. Is he ever going to make him out of prison, though? Oh, my God, he has well, his own flight school. there's time on Earth cut short. Why do some of us find ways to endure? Oh, and his appeal got rejected. Yeah, fuck you, Tyler. You fucking bitch. Yeah, fuck you too, Sharon. Damn, I hope... While others just wither on the vine. I don't know the answers, but I know I'm done running from shadows. Nobody's chasing me. Nobody ever was. Bro, a bigger fucking thing. Yo, dub that he's alive. Yo, now we're into a philosophical talk. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna talk about this because I want to talk about this. My biggest thing is like, have y'all ever thought about, like, your friend group or your family? Like, it's always kind of you envision it as, like, oh, you're going to die at the same time. But, like, my your entire friend group is going to die at drastically different times. Even your family. Like, obviously, it's presumed that your parents and grandparents are going to die before you. But if you have, like, brothers or sisters or cousins, like, you are likely to die after some of them or before some of them or friends like like friends specifically i mean like yeah i've i've like i had a few friends that have killed themselves but like outside of that just like natural death like that's like some people might die 20 years before you that you're friends with hey zoe uh, it's grandpa i was thinking about our conversation the other day about facing up to things, and uh, well, there's something I never told anyone. Yo, together for the five gifted. Thank you for the five gifted subs. Big dub in the chat. Jim calling her, telling her something. What the fuck is he that about to tell her? Day in Two Rock, when I suggested we take the scenic route, there was a reason. I'd been there before, you see. Everything that came. Afterwards. Oh, I forgot! Oh my god, Sharon knew him! Uh, Death's dream. All of it. I think it was all my fault. Please, you don't have to do this. 
just calm down and make this easy on yourself, okay? Tell him he can have it. It's all in two of them. What the fuck? I... Grandpa? Robot, no, and somebody said search up the other endings. Bro, I want to know that ending explained. He said it was his fault. Oh, but why was he hiding his face from Sharon? I forgot that. Sharon knew who he was. Fuck, dude. I got to look this up. As Dusk Falls ending explained. Oh, there might be a sequel in the series' future. Trying to find out why Jim died. Jim confesses to Zoe that he's been at Two Rock prior to the family's passing. Jim alludes to knowing Sheriff Romero and not wanting to be recognized. Jim may be connected to Sheriff's black book. Worrying that years later, Dante would remember him. Bro. So Jim might be the reason. That's fucking nuts. All right, that was a W game, chat. Cookie for the sub yellow for the three hundred bets. Get the other endings. As Dusk Falls, all endings. There are seven endings. Five endings include two deaths where the middle hole always dies. In one ending, Jay's executed. In one, he escapes to Mexico. Later reported to the police by Zoe. And one, he, he escapes to Canada. Oh, and lives freely or kills himself. Four endings have one death. Michelle lives in one and stays married to Vince. One, they get a, a divorce. What the fuck? The best ending. The best ending. Ugh. And the best ending, you could keep all lives alive. You could keep everybody alive. And keeping all the characters out of prison. But you have to not make one mess up. You have to forgive Michelle for the affair. Never would have done that, chat. Hide Joyce's bloody earring from Big Sam. Warn, warn Dale of the sniper. Make amends with the dad. Choose to sue the airline. Don't run from the door. Survive Dante's attack. Drop the weapon near the halts. Get out of the halts car. Save Bear from suicide. Save Tyler slipping out of the tree. Be honest with Vanessa. Jump into the water. Not tell Dante. Make amends with Jay. Choose to flee. Yeah, bro, there's no scenario where all of them would have died. Or all of them would have lived. All right. But we're going to call it there. That was a W stream. W chat. Thank you for everybody that tuned in. Uh, I will be live tomorrow at 4.30 p.m. EST. We will be doing an unbanned stream. And then we will be playing Toilet Chronicles, which is a funny slash uh, scary game. Scary slash funny game. 
Uh, and then maybe a Val game after that, depending. But we're going to start with Unbanned. Then we're going to do Toilet Chronicles. Then maybe some Val, depending. That'll all be tomorrow. Friday's going to be Reacts. Saturday, we're going to be doing Fortnite uh, and Valorant. Sunday's going to be Reacts. Monday is going to be my birthday stream. We're probably going to do a Watch Party React, some philosophy, some gaming. It's going to be a lot. Uh, still be like a three and a half, four hour stream on Monday, but we're going to be jumping all over the place. We're going to move Minecraft Monday to Wednesday, next Wednesday. Tuesday, I won't be live. Wednesday will be Minecraft because Monday we'll be doing my birthday stream. Next Thursday, we're probably going to do either an FMV or Fortnite and Val. Friday will be React Saturday. Next, next Saturday, or next Saturday will be Spy Party. And then Sunday, I won't be live because it'll be the Super Bowl. But yeah. I hope you guys had fun watching the stream. I had fun streaming for you guys. Uh, and we are going to raid Neural for the 1500 biddies. W stream, W game. Come in with the good content. My biological dad went to prison when I was younger, around 2011. To my knowledge, he doesn't get out until 2020 or 2042. Visiting him for the first time next month. Damn. Let me know how it goes. Dairy for the sub. Uh, and Neural for the 1500 biddies. He said for the 300 bits. Says read the bits. My biggest fear is getting stabbed or shot. Or falling, shit like that, and surviving, like, life has to suck ass after that. Why would it suck ass after surviving? On topic of death, I lost my mom to cancer at the age of eight. I'm 16 now, been struggling lately, and your streams help a lot. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, I'm glad my streams could help, and I'm sorry that your mom passed at a young age. Um, that really does suck. Uh, I'm glad my streams could help um, in any way that they can. But yeah, somebody said Raid Nolan is overweight. I'm, I don't know who I'm going to raid. Who do we want to raid today, chat? We could raid Keep Up Radio. She's playing Fortnite. Let's raid Keep Up Radio. Because I raided Nolan the other day. All right. Chat, I will be live tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow for an unbanned stream where you guys decide whether or not people get banned uh, or unbanned. Uh, then we're going to be doing Toilet Sim, maybe some uh, Valorant. Uh, then Friday Reacts, Saturday, uh, some Fortnite and Val. Sunday Reacts, Monday, my birthday stream, where we're probably going to be doing some watch party shit of some longer YouTube videos, some philosophy, and maybe some gaming. I don't really know what games we would play yet. Maybe Switch Sports, uh, Fall Guys, whatever the fuck I feel like on my birthday. Tuesday off, Wednesday, we will play Minecraft. And then next Thursday, we will probably do an FMV game or maybe some Fortnite. But yeah. Hope you, had, hope you guys had fun watching the stream. I'll see you guys later. We are going to raid in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Is it going to fucking raid, dude? It literally, it just like glitches. Yep, there it is.